Wow. Wow, guys. Wow. You know, I, I wasn't even going to transition yet. But I'm seeing the chat and I'm seeing people call me Hufflepuff, Porsche, Hufflepuff, Huff. Bitch, I ain't no damn Hufflepuff, okay? I'm a fucking slivering at heart. I used to have a crush <laughs> on Draco Malfoy. Ew, guys, ew, 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 ew. Um. By the way, this is this is the game music, so I didn't even have to open Spotify today. You know, you Hufflepuff personified top pushy. Nathan, I don't appreciate the verbal abuse. I really don't. Draco Malfoy looks like Eminem. Yeah, he, he's literally like the fucking Eminem of the wizarding world. Do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I'm joking. Um, okay, give me a second. I'm just posting on my social media. Oh god, it's like a long, long process. <laughs> Guys, I'm literally wearing gloves, my hands are so cold. But I need to take them off, otherwise I can't play properly. Why then? Oh damn. Who's Mr. Y himself talking to? Why then the Porsche? <laughs> Oh my god. But anyways guys, today is an important day. Today is the day I become a wizard. Well technically a witch. But today we're going to be sorted into the house, complete quests and learn spells. Yay! <laughs> Ew. Um, so stick around. Uh, just a, just a little heads up. I actually played a tiny weenie, weenie, weenie bit back in February when I actually downloaded the game. I haven't touched it since February, um, because I thought I was going to start streaming at that time and I just didn't, and I didn't get to play the game. But now I'm here streaming it and I'm going to play it. Um, yeah. So I do actually have a character and when I did play, I actually got put into Gryffindor and I was upset. So I changed it to Slytherin. <laughs> so no, I'm not no Hufflepuff ass bitch. Okay, please. How utterly dare you play without streaming? <laughs> Listen, I, I wasn't ready back then. Okay, it's not my fault. But yeah, I, I don't really know much about the game going forward. I did see like Miss Kiff and a few other streamers playing it when it did release. <sighs> but quite frankly, I'm a bit worried because I've been having some graphics issues with this game. Like it was stuttering and I've just spent like the past 30 minutes trying to like fix my graphic settings. And I read online on Reddit that other people were having this issue on PC and it's better to play on PS5. But hopefully it's sorted now, hopefully it runs smoothly. If it discombobulates, then I'm sorry, I'm switching games. <laughs> or if I have too many howlers, I'm switching games as well. So please, please limit the verbal abuse, okay? I am a muggle who doesn't know any... <laughs> no, I'm sorry, sorry. I am just a normal person who is bad at games, okay? Okay. That's why we got whiff in the title. Um... Lauren walked so Hufflepuff could run. No, guys, please do not attach me to that house. I, no, 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 no. No. Wasn't Fingy in Hufflepuff? What's his name? Frederick Diggory. I'm pretty sure he was in Hufflepuff, right? Nathan finally came out. I 
Okay. Oh yeah. See, guys, this was my character. I don't know why she looks like that because she actually looks better in the game. <laughs> like she looks so weird there. I'm sorry. Like she, <laughs> she actually looks weird. Um. But yeah, that's that's my attire, my little skirt and cape. Would you call this a cape? Cloak, not cape. Cloak. That's what I meant. Oh my god. Um. But yeah, I was fixing it up today. Your character got a screw face. Cedric was Hufflepuff. Yeah, see, see, Cedric walked so Hufflepuff could run. Okay, he he's the man that put Hufflepuff on the map. <laughs> yeah, don't attach me to no Hufflepuff. All right, let's not go there. Oh, look, we've got a letter as well. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted to Hogwarts at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. Term begin begins. <laughs> no, this is so cringe. This is actually cringe. Oh my god. Ew. On the 1st of September. <laughs> Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle. Blah 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 blah. <laughs> oh oh, I have to remake my character. Oh, that is so annoying. I think it was this one that I picked, but I just changed her face a little bit. I mean, the options are just so great, aren't they? <laughs> oh my god, she's online. Yes, fishy. Hello, hello. How are you doing? No guys, look look at the look at the options. I just can't. I actually can't. <laughs> Ugh. What is this? Okay, this is kind of cute. <laughs> I really don't know what to say. I'm just gonna stick with the normal. Ew. Oh hell no. Need new hair. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it. I'm gonna put the scar back on my eye because I like I like the scar. I did that with my Elden Ring character. And I'm gonna make the eye color grey again. There we go. I don't know. I, I literally. <laughs> the first one ain't it. <laughs> okay, well, so what hair, Raheem? Like, honestly, the choices are a bit. They're a bit mid. Like, what is this? I need to zoom out to see if it goes with the outfit. Do you know what I mean? Like, okay, we're gonna have to do that. We're gonna have to do that. It's a bit long, but. I do kind of like the half up, half down. That's kind of cute. Oh god. Oh. It. Uh. Do you know what? It kind of reminds me of like Jacob from Twilight. I don't know why. <laughs> Um, <laughs> um, in Harry Potter, diversity gone out the window. She looks native as fuck. Yeah, she kind of does. I think it's like the skin tone. There's not really anyone that looks like me, you know? Where's the Caucasian? <laughs> no, I'm not picking this one. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. This. I think she's the best one out of them all, you know? Let's see this one. Change the skin. I, I don't know if I can't. Wait, hold on. Let's see. No, I can't click on it. Um, 
Face. Okay, there we go. There we go. Yes, 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 yes. Where's the? <laughs> I didn't. I didn't even see that. I'm so blind. Okay, maybe a bit whiter because I'm actually quite pale. Oh, oh, <laughs> no, she looks like a ghost here. No, that's crazy. That's crazy. Uh, Sutton, not right with this. Okay, I'll leave it as this one because this is kind of like my color. Um, face, face shape. Oh. Oh dear. Um. Um. I don't know what to say at this point. I really don't. <laughs> It's not like I'm gonna find my face on this, but <laughs> oh, that's a that's a no to the glasses, an absolute no. Oh, pink. Why don't we make her look like Gojo? Just give her white hair. <laughs> uh, is there brown? Uh, the color, yeah, a bit meaty. I'm just gonna, you know, I'm just gonna st stick with, stick with like this, like set. You know, obviously I don't look like this, but from the options that we have, this is as good as it's gonna get, guys. Um, complexion. Oh, bags. I definitely got bags under my eyes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, there's the bags. Yeah. The insomnia bags. <laughs> she looks tired. She looks like she's been studying too many <laughs> spells. I don't know. What do you think, guys? Should I add the bags? Or nothing? Maybe this one. Because this, uh, this is a bit much, isn't it? She looks, looks a bit... It's looking crazy out here. Oh, we could do... Mm, we could do this one. Fuck it, let's just do this one, whatever. <laughs> we don't need to think too much into this. Oh wow, fucking money brow up in this bitch. <laughs> Actually, this kind of looks like my eyebrows. You know, I'll just I'll just leave it like this, isn't it? That's cute. Hmm. Ah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This is actually tough. Why am I actually like overthinking this? Okay, this, yeah, this looks like my eyebrows, actually. Yes, okay. We'll go with that. That's cute. She's cute. What's voice one? I am indeed a student. Good, good, oh, good. Oh, good. God. And some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Oh, God. <laughs> thank you, Rick, for the follow. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, A balanced gameplay challenge. Okay, guys, I, I'm actually scared because remember with the other RPG games, <laughs> I was struggling even on normal mode, so I don't really know. Oh, God. Oh, God, oh, God. 
That was quite something. I'm eager to get to Hog. I am indeed. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. guys characters all set up <laughs> you're welcome oh god ah it appears we are almost ready to depart Ew. it's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting i presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on i have professor well I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the time begins. Oh! <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm -hmm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I'd been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. This just sounds too British, like a stereotypical British. <laughs> it actually does. Traveling companion. A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock, 
I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We did. See the, the flying um, thingies because we just saw someone die. You can only see them if I think someone has died right in front of you. I can't remember what they're called by the way. The key. But I remember them in the Half Blood Prince. Give me your hand. Damn. <laughs> oh god. Um, it's set in the 1800s. Zeno, make sure you go to school first. Pay attention. This game is fun. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I've played I played like this bit when it came out, but then I stopped. It's <laughs> potion. But hopefully we can get far in the game. Uh, okay, so G is hill. But yeah guys, sorry if the game stutters, like it it's literally the game. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... He got yammed. What the hell got into that damn thing? I'm playing Attack it right now. Carriage, oh my god. How Attack far in the game are you? Never. Professor? <sighs> Sir? <sighs> where are we? I'm not sure. About but that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. I'm level 10. Oh, okay. See, i done this bit. I can't really remember it fully. But I got to the bit where I had to speak to Professor Fig in the actual, like, school. And then How I stopped there. <laughs> take us? Farther from London than the carriage travelled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think... The port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see <laughs> Good. if we can find a path, however faded it may be. All right. George got yammed up, Rip Bozo. <laughs> wow. Mind your step. Where I rest in peace, George. I've got the port key that brought us here. A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key. Bruh. But I am Get your certain ass up it here. was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> but sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. 
What really matters is the one who wields it. Surround sound is really good. I like it. If you want is to, you can pick your own house. Yeah. It's not oh my god, I got put in Gryffindor, but it appears to be I'm, I'm not a Gryffindor Goro, so I changed Someone it to Slytherin. What house did you get put in? Let's see some of that one work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Uh, tap to perform a basic cast. Oh. There we go. Use your camera to select an active target. Oh, okay. Okay. That makes sense. Slytherin? Ah, oh, see? Slivering gang! Slivering gang! <laughs> Slytherin is the best house, in uh, my opinion. <laughs> that was a bit rougher than I expected. Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Ah, up there. Oh. I'm just a small girl. We're close now. It's just ahead. Professor Fig is suspicious as fuck. E e e e e I don't know. We'll just have to see. <laughs> Steady yourself. Repair. Oh my god! Almost it's Eren Yeager! Eren! Eren! <laughs> no, I'm playing. <laughs> I'm actually playing. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. The minimap shows your surroundings with you in the middle. This is the current objective. Press and hold V to toggle quest objective details. It just seems like he's hiding some evil plan. I mean, innocent till proven guilty, you know. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Hmm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. We have to find something else. <laughs> I'm just breaking stuff just in case like there's anything in it but I don't think there was from what I can remember oh yeah there's something here professor this statue this may have been his home oh there's something okay maybe I need to go around here Oh, this does right now. I'm so blind. <laughs> Remember the gun mod people put in this game? That enchanted yes! crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! I think that's the bank, isn't it? Is he coming? Oh, there he is. Odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted oh God, stone look at my face. here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? 
I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? We're in the bank, right? I don't believe it. Oh, look, yeah. Yeah. There's a goblin right there. Hello? <clears throat> I said, <clears throat> Side eye, she just did. Uh, just a <laughs> moment. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> uh, <we're> here. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key. Mm -hmm. Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. They didn't use the guy from Tenable, like in the film. Yeah, I thought they would have used, like, the, the same goblin. After you. But maybe it's maybe it's a and different keep your hands inside era. The cards and she didn't. You don't wish to didn't they die? I think they died. Do you remember? And definitely, definitely hollow, hollows. Yeah, hollows. I think they died. How many no. are there in I don't know what era this is set in. in like, fact, if it's before we'll or after. It's probably before, isn't 12. it? As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power. 1800, so that's before could have arranged for such a service. All the stuff happens. You want to take a breath? So oh, I what? think it would be different people working that here. That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's yeah. downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Well, it has Vault legacy number in the name. Vault was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. I don't know, man. We, we just gotta have to see how it plays out. Of the bank. So but yeah, we've quite a distance Rick and uh, Raheem said it was 1800s. Number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> Momentous mm. day. <laughs> On your way. wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Here we are. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12. Until today. Vault 12. Thank 
you for your help. What is that? What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Oh. Yeah, it's the legacy of Hogwarts, not Harry Potter. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Rebellion. There! I saw something! Move a bit closer and try again. A door? Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw in the portkey container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. I think this is the bit Blue where moss. all the knights drop down. And oh my god, this when I no first played it, I had a howler. I suspect we will need Guys. to earn our way out of here. What do you mean? Earn Be prepared for whiffs. Do you think it's this coming? Is some <laughs> sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. It's supposed to be 1847 with who the head, I see who the headmaster. Head. What is it? Wait, so that glow again, but on the floor. What um I don't know if it is kind of related. What What era is Fantastic Beasts set in? Cuz I know Fantastic Beasts is somewhat related to Harry Potter. What happened? Uh-oh. No. When I moved towards the, the knights glow, Suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Uh -oh. Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. 1920s and 1950s onwards. What oh, statue? okay. So this is even before I see some then. some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Um. Oops. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. This is way before, floor. yeah. Way it is. before <laughs> the reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Oh, I'm so scared. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. Okay, let's go. Ew, look at her face. <laughs> Uh, tap one to cast Lumos. Lumos. Lumos! Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Ah, ah, don't. Fantastic Beast is 65 years before Harry Potter. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Look out! God, guys! Protego! <laughs> Let you 
Oh shit, I didn't see that one. Oh shit, no, this is what I have a howl of Oh shit, no. Ugh. Oh my god, oh my god, wait, I need to back up. <laughs> oh, okay. You know what? It actually tells me when there's an attack coming. There we go. Okay, now I'm paying attention. Okay. <laughs> Get out of here! Run! So we've only got a basic cast right now. So it's not doing too much damage. Yeah, you have spider sense. Ugh, I didn't even realize that. Like, okay. Now that I know, Professor? I think Professor I can uh, lock in a bit Professor, more. Where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? I find Professor Fig. What's Fee? happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Oh god, oh god, oh god. with their reflections with their reflections okay ah! oh shit that is so difficult all right we've got one two and we need one more i remember when i first did this like i was actually struggling bitch yeah there's more i think there's more um hold q during protego to stun enemies with a stupefy counter attack i had a hard time there also yeah like literally like i i don't really play like rpg games um i've only recently started playing them because i got a bit bored of fps games and like i don't have like normal like in-game sense and knowledge that other people might have so i was just struggling so much like i had to watch a youtube video but now that i'm like seeing like certain things it's a bit easier but yeah i'm probably still gonna struggle regardless how do i do it like a quick counter attack. I have to do it quite quick. Oh! Oh my god. Yeah, it's quite quick. I think that one is gonna charge up. Stupefy. <laughs> I feel like I'm playing Elden Ring right now. <laughs> oh shit. Where are we going? Where are we going? Lumos. This way.
Is this a memory? Basin. Oh, yes. That is a pensive for viewing memories. Yes, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna I see wonder. a memory. Too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability oh, to yes. see what others cannot she will can not be enough, magic. Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. He was in the newspaper. my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful.
Almost got squashed like a bug. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Pretty. Oh god guys. Hope you guys are enjoying it so far. <laughs> Kinda takes long to get into the game as well. I think it's just the developers, yeah. I think they need to fix this a little bit. Just just a tad, you know? God, it's, it's taking so long. <laughs> All right, finally. Oh, good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Guys, it's time. Jealous. Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were du -du -du. complications. Lauren ninety six hot cocoa. It seems the goblin Enough. problem has goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, <laughs> the accent is actually killing me. I'm losing patience. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Thank you for subscribing, Amari. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Guys, I'm telling you. Professor Weasley! We've won more to I'm be putting sliver in, okay? All right. You're just in if not Slytherin, then it'll be Gryffindor. But if it's Gryffindor, <laughs> I'm changing it to Slytherin. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? Oh. 
See, he you knows I'm a granny. You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Uh... I can't wait to explore. I can't wait to start classes. <laughs> Classes. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Hmm. I wonder... Hmm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm, what is it? Daring, curiosity, loyalty, ambition. I'm gonna say ambition. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. True. Mm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. An eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong <gasps> in Slytherin. Oh! <laughs> what did I tell you guys? What did I tell you? I'm a Slytherin girl. I'm a Slytherin girl. I'm a Slytherin girl in a Slytherin world. <laughs> no, fuck you guys who said I was going to be putting Hufflepuff. Yeah? Ain't no Hufflepuff bitch over here. Y'all already know. I'm accepting that. <laughs> you belong in Slytherin! With my man, Draco. <laughs> Draco Malfoy. <laughs> yep, we've got the green. Here we go, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Alright, guys, yep. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Oh, hell no, man. Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. He said, chop, chop, get the book out of here. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honour to show you to your common room. Right this way. You already know, guys. Red hair and a hand-me-down robe must be a Weasley. <laughs> no, I'm actually so cringy. It Ew. may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Oh. Nice. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Cutscenes are so good. Oh my god, look at my room. <laughs> oh, looks it's like so everyone's cute. gone. Better head to the common room. Oh my god. 
Welcome to Hogwarts. Find your common room. Let me look at. Wait, hold on. Hey, 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 relax. <laughs> Camera doing too much. Oh. Very green. I do like the Gryffindor common room, though. <gasps> I suppose some introductions are in order. It's a lot more like homely and warm. Uh, introduce yourself to Melda. Okay. Already knew that. Sebastian. Can I help you? Uh. Oh, you're the new fifth year. Oh, I'm Sebastian <laughs> Sallow. What's going Welcome on here? Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. Professor Fig and I were lucky to escape with our lives. Indeed. And how did you escape? Oh, he, he seems so a smart. A blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough, but not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. Oh, he's so sus. <laughs> it was nice meeting you, Sebastian. I'll let you get back to your book. He, he, nice he's meeting you too. many red flags Good luck right today. now. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. You should have listened to me. Ah, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. We handled it, and I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. Ha, <laughs> not the way I fly. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. Is she on the I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Goodbye, Imelda. <laughs> nice meeting you. I... I think I heard one. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered Ew, the common room, I'm scary. guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. Uh, uh, I'd much rather have arrived on time and without a dragon attack en route. I'm sure. How horrible. I can only imagine. Well, it's good to have you in Slytherin. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here. <laughs> she looks so awkward. She's like, um, get me the fuck away from these people. <laughs> Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status. A pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Did the 
that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Right. Um... Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Oh god, she runs bare fast. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the Headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. <laughs> Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. I what certainly would have appreciated something like a field chest. guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Do keep up. Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue Revelio. and see what details the field guide can provide? Where is the guide page? Oh, there we go. Kelpie statue. This statue depicts the Kelpie. Okay. Selecting your first guide. Um. Give me a second, guys. Clever, isn't it? <laughs> Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. I'm not open this yet. Rebellia. Rebellia.
The details are really good. That's one thing I know for sure. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Select the Grand Staircase region to continue. In this view you can see the flue flames available in that region. Discovered including your own house and con Professor Wheezy has unlocked the central hall flu flame for you. Use AD to rotate the map and fast travel to the center. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry guys, we're getting there. The action will come soon. And here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but... I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Can't be chatty patties. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. <laughs> Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today, and remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you, and invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. 
And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was so hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. This represents main quests. Completing main quests will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. Some requests are locked by spell or level requirements. New spells can be earned by completing professor's assignments or as quest rewards. Okay, we'll do we'll do the defense against the dark arts class that's what we'll do first the map is enchanted to help you find your way this will be incredibly helpful thank you now sounds like you've quite a day ahead what with classes and a trip to hogsmeade for supplies including your own wand you'll enjoy mr ollivander he's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend nice. i shall reach out when i have more information we're gonna get our wand our as well mysterious locket for now, focus on your classes oh and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. All right, let's go to the class now. They got dinosaurs up in this bitch. That's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. Are you ready, guys? <laughs> You'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity. Especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice. Guys, what who we've remembers? Just learned. It's not Leviosa. It's Leviosa. <laughs> like, bruh.
It's Leviosa. Leviosa. Now, let's try something a little larger. What a crackhead. Listen, I'm, I'm in my element right now. I was born to be a witch. <laughs> what gang did you get? I got Slytherin, of course. Let us begin with when I first did cost. it back in February, I got put in Gryffindor. And then I changed it to Slytherin. But this time, I just got Slytherin off the drop. Do you know what I mean? Because, you know, I'm a Slytherin girl in a Slytherin world. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a winner. Good. Now, well done. Very good. But the best way to practice All right. is by duel. We're gonna smoke this guy. We'll start with you. We're gonna smoke him. He's getting Duelist, cooked. take your marks. He ain't so ready for me, man. Bon Sebastian. I want a fair duel using only Leviosa. He ain't ready. Basic cast. He ain't ready. And Protego. You may begin. I'm gonna smoke his ass. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready, guys? Protego. What? About it. Idiot. Pussy -o. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Not bad. For you got beginner. yeah. You give as good <laughs> as you get. <laughs> Smug little little fool. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. Thank you, <laughs> Professor hey. Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity. Slivering in their bag. Slivering is in their bag right now because of me. We can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. Yes, sir. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Pussy oh, is crazy. Right. Hey, That's listen. Enough spectacle for one day. He was Class being real dismissed. smug earlier, okay? He was being real smug in the common room. So I had to lay him down. You know, I had, I had, to, I had to smoke him. Why is she side-eyeing me? Did anyone see that? She just twists up her neck just to look at me. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Mm -hmm. huh, fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Oh, here we go. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now. You have then. a slit in the eyebrow. Yeah, a my real eyebrow has a slit as well. Because I've got a scar on my eyebrow. <laughs> That's why I got it on my on my character too. To get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure. But actually, it's like you. a scar. I'm sure yeah. I'll see you soon. Hers Perhaps is a scar, but mine we'll isn't see if your today a long scar enough. like that. Or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. Clock tower entrance. <sighs> you have uncollected rewards available. Okay, go to charms class. Alright guys, how did you bust your head? I don't know, I was quite young. I think I did it 
when I was going to the shop with my dad, I was Handy on my. Like, uh, I think. Guide. I don't know what happened. I, I kind of remember. I don't remember. It's like, I think I fell off a gate or something. I really can't remember. I was very young. I was going to ask if the character was accurate. I mean, obviously I don't look entirely like this. I mean, I could have my hair like this and my eyebrows pretty much look like that, but the rest of the features, no. There wasn't really any anyone that like looked similar to me. I mean, I didn't really try hard <laughs> to look. Um, but yeah, this, this is the best that it gets, Amari. I'm telling you, like the character options are a bit needy <laughs> how far is charms class oh my god is it all the way up here silly billy she tripped into a lamppost not a lamppost i fell off a gate a, a metal gate professor ronan tends to go on a bit is this we charms class have to remind him to finish oh it's in there okay some of us Dusty witch, wow. You're a dusty Porsche. Here. Looking Behind like Snape's you. daughter. <laughs> there is an open seat here. <laughs> oh my Thank god. You. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Natty. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> oh, who's Ronan? Shall we begin? Is that, is that Reeves Ronan? <laughs> Welcome to year Reeves five Ronan. of Charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold <laughs> with the passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbook to page five. Taking I you back to Reeves Ronan's but roots. Before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the Color change and growth charms. Hmm. Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Uh, 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 uh. I uh, am uh, afraid uh. it is too late to study now. Hmm. <laughs> My, oh the summer God. months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you? Even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm. Hmm? Bro, I just got here. Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite church. sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Oh, Akio. Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Aki spell, you know, Lauren is a soul fish. <laughs> now, Nathan, Nathan, please, what do you have against salt fish? Like, you actually have something against salt fish. You don't like salt fish patties. You're calling me salt fish. And now you're saying the spell is Aki and I'm salt fish. Like, what is going on here? What is going on? That's actually funny. Nathan, go back to Skid Row, you Porsche man. Damn. Are you seeing this, Nathan? Are you seeing this? Are you going to have that? 
Aki and Saltfish is calm, yeah, yeah. I do love Aki and Saltfish, to be honest, but... Listen, I don't know why you're not with the, the Saltfish parties. That actually I've yummy. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree, hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport? Look at his eyes. It's like popping out his head. Charm to the test, right? <laughs> <laughs> what are these sound effects? <laughs> so why don't we have our newest student start us off? Hmm? Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. What am I doing? Very simply, the summoning charm Akio. On one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, oh! Oh, 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 oh no. My bad. Very good. <gasps> Fifty. Splendid. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Yeah. All right. That's a hundred, no? Very good. Points to Slytherin. Yay. <laughs> but there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new Lock in, man. I'm sorry, I didn't realise that I had to get it onto the, the numbered bit. I thought he wanted me to drag it towards me. You'll be the blues just as before. And Miss Onai, <sighs> you are playing Is she going to go fast? Clear? First? Yes, sir. So fast. First? Yeah, she is. Here we go. Oh, my God. Oh no, I'm gonna be so bad. That is how it's done. <laughs> oh, oh shit, 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 I was meant to press four. Oh my god, I'm not locked in, guys, I'm so sorry. So I have to press four to let it go. I pressed my left button for some reason. Because usually with these spells, <laughs> you have to press your mouse button, but with this one is a bit different. Oh god, four. Come on, come on, come on. Fifty? That's it! Huh? What's okay. This? Retirement soon. No, no, this spell is just a bit different. I have to press number four and then four again. So my mouse is not involved. Fifty? Nicely done. Ah, oh, I fucked up, man. Oh, bitch. Listen, you only won because I fumbled. I sabotaged Let us myself. Let's make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Yes, yes. Rematch, rematch. All right, I'm not gonna fumble, guys. <laughs> I think I'm not we gonna are do well it. Past interesting at this point. Okay. <laughs> I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Here we go. Oh, was that? Is that forty? That's oh, thirty. Done. Okay. Oh God. Come on, come on, come on, come on! 50? That is 50. Yes! Oh, she's got 60. There we go. Ooh! <gasps> What's that? 30. Uh, I've still got more than her anyways. <laughs> oh, she fucked up. <laughs> she actually fucked up, man. Alright, let me do this last one. Move, man. Head is in the way. Um... No, stop, stop. Oh, you busted. To the best of us. No.
No. Very good, both of you. Well done. Okay, clearly I'm not good at that spell. The state of your <laughs> listen, guys, guys, I'm better with the with the combat stuff. Okay, this is just irrelevant. Okay, this is not combat. This is just Akio, Aki and Saltfish. Okay, We're gonna put that to the side for now. I'm gonna put it to the side. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. So I was good at stuplify. I was good at um. Well done back there. You took uh, yeah, the, the other one as well. Right. Didn't want to go too easy on you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Aww. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, She's we had so left cute. Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. You can cast spells without a wand? Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. <laughs> it's huh? nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Of course, you can A word, use if you would. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? Miss Onai is a talented witch. Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Oh god. I'm sorry guys, I'm trying to eat my biscuits as well. After my brother learned the summoning charm, oh, God, it was boy. constant Akio this, Akio that. Um, <clears throat> okay. <laughs> She's talking too much. Side quests are now available. Available side quests can be found in side regions of Hogwarts, marked as. Um, but do not advance to me, sorry. Okay, I don't really want to do side quests. I need to unlock some more of those, um, what's it called? Whatever they're called, I can't remember what they're called, honestly. Those little fire things. Is there any near me? Hold on. It's 
place is quite big. What's that? What the hell? Oh my god. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. <gasps> Guys. Of course I find a cat. I'm literally a cat mum. IRL. And in game. No, sorry. I need to pet this cat a bit more. Oh, how cute. It's a little floof. I'm sure it's obviously not a cat, but it's probably some other breed. I mean, look at it. It doesn't look like a normal cat, does it? Um, but yeah, let's get to the class and learn some more spells. What's good, Big Ed? Oh my god, here we go. Here we go. Here, here's the troll. Top troll. I'm alright, how are you doing? How you doing, May? I think I need to go through here. Um. Oh, this is nice. Okay. I see the game kind of stutters. Oh my god! Oh my god, another cat. Oh my god. I'm, I, I can't believe it. I, I feel so content here. Oh. I'm li like literally <laughs> the cats just keep coming. Oh. All right, goodbye now. Your favorite troll. Oh my god. <laughs> what about the room, professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. His hair is crazy. Oh my oh, god, there's a cat in the picture! Deke. Oh my god. Ah, there you are. <laughs> Look at a cat! I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that really trying regard, to get a I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra He's assignments. in my business. Uh, yeah. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, oh we've God. arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. When do I get and my wand? And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. Oh my wand. god. You've managed so your excited. classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or oh, Natsai Ola. I've noticed you spending time with them. Uh, who should I pick, guys? Should I pick Sebastian? <laughs> I think I should pick him because he's a little bastard and he's just so smug. I do like Natty though. She is nice. She's really kind. Oh god, I, I think Sebastian. Let's see how it goes. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard, and he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavoury local. 
Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Theophil what? Theophilus? What? Theophilus is a crazy subject, name. Your friend will meet you at the castle doors. <laughs> Rook no Wide. time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, Rook the Wood. sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the three broomsticks. Oh, a butterbeer. Guys, I've heard butterbeer is really nasty. Like, everyone who goes to, like, the, like, Universal Studios or, like, the Harry Potter thing in, in a... In London, they say it's not nice. Is it Universal or would it- Yeah, I think it'll be at Universal, isn't it? In America. But yeah, they say it's not nice and yeah, avoid, but you know what? Just try it for yourself before you listen to people's opinions. Lauren! Chop! Oh my god! How are you doing? So glad you could join my stream! Alright. So we have to- Report to Professor Bronin to do more work. Guys, look. Look at the cat. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. Look at it. So pretty. Wait, something's making a noise in here. Revelia. Maybe it's nothing. Okay, I'm just going to leave it. Um, oh my god, another cat? Wait, is that the same? No, it's a different one. Oh my god, he, he just walked past it. So cute. Guys, I'm not even trying to be funny, but every cat that I see, I'm going to stroke it. Okay. Are you an evil witch or a good witch? I'm great, how are you? I'm okay, I'm okay. Okay, well, the thing is, for now, I'm a good witch, until someone pisses me off. I'm joking, no. I'm a good witch, I'm a good witch. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor? Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm, it seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Ropero in no time. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. No matter what she says, it's always evil. She's putting up a front. No! I'm a good witch, okay? Trust me. This is the right area. I what wonder where the was hey, pages. What the hell was that? Hey, hey, hey! Hey! What are you doing here? Uh, is it number two? Okay, there we go. Yes! Oh my god. You see that? You have unco- Huh? Collect field guide pages in Hogwarts. Do I really have to do that? Revelia. Collect the flying pages in the defen- Wait, blah, 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 blah. Collect the flying page in the defense against the dark arts tower. Okay. So we need to go to the tower. Oh, going the wrong way. Wait, what the hell is that? What is it? What's that? Let me <gasps> Whoa. That's crazy. Oh, we got a teleport right there. I think I need to un wait. What are you up to now? Oh, it's already been unlocked because it's green. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Revelia. Oh, it's locked. Um. Oh, there it is. If only a new student oh, were to help me. Brilliant. 
here. Return to Professor Ronan. Let's go, let's go. Hold on, let me double check what that is. I can see that here. Not a one of them deserves more than it's. Let me also. Okay, me Rebellion. Oh. Ooh. Painting of Ilias. Okay. A hundred and forty two staircases, and this is where they put me. Wait, is it the painting that's Never forget what that awful puff girl said in 1421. What lovely stone. Oh, oh that's class, that is. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I trust the preliminary task. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. All right. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Oh my god, F? Okay, they changed it. New spell unlocked. The mending charm repairo can be used to mend broken objects and pieces of the environment. That's it! Very good! If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized Rebellion. heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought you written lashed out. Okay, where is that? Oh no, wait, is that... Meet Sebastian near the entrance of Hogsmeade. Oh. oh, near the entrance to Hogwarts, sorry. <laughs> uh, Reparo is number three. Reparo. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> All right. How do I go there? Wait, hold on, hold on. Is it through that? Yes, okay. Rebellion. What is this? Whoa. That's kind of scary. Look at that. Oh my god. Anyways. I've noticed, like, when you run too fast in this game, it stutters. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I tried transforming a rabbit into a Revelia. Look at this. Oh my god. <laughs> oh god, it's Well, fancy stuttering. meeting you here. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavour to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's <laughs> a charming so little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Guys, I'm excited to get my wand. I'm so excited. <laughs> I hope it's not ugly.
Oh my god, so pretty. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. Oh, oh the only God. one who's ever bested me in a duel. They need to patch this, like, I seriously. It, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Oh, God, the stuttering is Speaking just too of much. Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well-rounded. If I go at this Speaking pace, it doesn't start as trip much. trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve Look at this chasing the bad boys. You know, I could have picked Natty, but I want to pick Sebastian because he's a little smug bastard, and I just want to see what so he has to say. How did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. <laughs> oh god, Amari. I don't chase after men, okay? I'll never chase after a man. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. Merlin's beard. Oh on? God. See for yourself. Quite a <gasps> oh my God! It's those things. You oh my God! Certainly don't see that every day. Oh my God! Oh, I can't remember what they're called. <laughs> you think already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. Why do we already? To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Why do we have to Hence run here? Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need Look, to have man's more already out of breath. Our defensive abilities. <laughs> I think it's uh, already it's dangerous. Just those <gasps> like, up ahead. what? Fake Harry Potter fan? Well, actually, this is not Harry Potter. Have you this had is much of a Hogwarts and Nicky. <laughs> Listen, uh, my brain, I, my brain's just gone blank. I can't remember I've what they called. Five years and barely scratched can't the remember a damn thing. Loads to see, places to discover. Oh, any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. Oh I god, go the stuttering is just so now, ridiculous. You still I'm haven't gonna... told me how you became so good at Oh, jubilee. it's making me cringe. Please, developers, please, please fix this. Like, it's it's too much. It's ridiculous. I don't want to have like a stuttery stream. I've always thought it's not even the stream. It's literally the game. Grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. No, nah, it's but not my PC. I actually looked at it um, too. before. Most notably, like even people attack. with quite like high uh, specs were having issues. Event. It's actually the game itself. But apparently it's a lot better to play on PS5. Like it's a lot smoother. So those of you that have a PS5, maybe get it on PS5 instead of PC. So you don't Mr. have to deal with this. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Who the hell is Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fit Mr. Yet? Moon? Pleasure. Uh, is this like Cindy Moon's back, dad, bro? Like, what the fuck uh, is going turn on here? And run. <laughs> is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. A Demi oh. guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, and he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. Mr. Moon is quite a lot of people. Character. All systems crumble in the tunnel. Yeah, a lot of people are saying on Reddit that when they were going to Hogsmeade, it just kept oh, stuttering is your so much. She is. I can see it. I can see. She <laughs> She's not well at the moment. Sorry, the rest she of the game has been fine so far, to be honest. But this part has just been the worst. Oh, god damn! Y'all see that? Get your GPU up. No, my GPU is fine. 
Literally, it's on Reddit. You, it's not my PC. Honestly, if one could bottle the magic of this place, a lot of people were saying bad stuff about like the people, how there's just something it felt like they just they just threw it out and flock to it like they had a flame. fix it later kind of attitude. Allegedly, well, no, go look online, mate. Um. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with a new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. Oh I just God. had to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. So I get my wand now? Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Uh, Hogsmeade Village is brimming with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using your field guide map. I've struck a nerve. Um, no, you've not really struck a nerve. I don't really, you know, I don't need to listen to men. Because men, men are tinky. <clears throat> uh, uh, you can, points of interest, okay. Zonko's Joke Shop, The Free Broomsticks, Hogsmeade Square. Why Mead? Steeply and Sons, Honey Dukes. <gasps> Where's the wand? Hog's Head. Yeah, let's just go to Ollivander's, which is behind me, I think. Okay. Um, visit Ollivander's. Oh god, okay guys, we're gonna get the wand. Uh, oh, there's, wait, is there a chest there? Till fingerless gloves. Ooh, cute. I'll be right Guys, with. I actually have a wand. Ah, <laughs> Someone gifted it to me um, a few years ago. Just a moment, please. I think it's Harry's wand that I have. Uh, mm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand? Yes. It's about time. Yes, I... About time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you oh, are. His wand. Oh, his Ollivander's wand. the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? So excited! Uh, oh my god. No, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes. yes. Oh, green. Hmm. Green box. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Uh, hmm. Ten and a half <laughs> inches, I'll take that. Here, give this one a try. Oh, well, go no. ahead, swish. Hmm. Hmm. How odd. I don't think the Once gold goes with the outfit. Really swish it. I... Yeah. Yeah. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um... We'll Best give me a pretty one. Mm. No, not you. Uh, <laughs> you can't <get> ready. <laughs> uh, mm. Perhaps. Please be pretty. Yes. Please be cute. A rare wood, thirteen and three quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Um, what is that? No, that is fogly. Oh, 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 oh thank God. Looks Thank like God. Back to the shelf for you. I'm so happy that's uh, not my wand. That is just ugly. This is proving to be trickier than I, I really had would. anticipated. Yeah, give me a give me a I'll ten inch rail. Um, <laughs> where are you? Perhaps you uh, ah, a purple one. There you are. Purple box. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! No! Oh, I thought I was gonna get the purple one. Yes. Why is it all green? I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Oh my 
Oh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Um, ew. Okay, I'm gonna go with wood type maple, core type dragon heartstring, flexibility reasonable, re reasonably su supple, twelve and a half inches. <sighs> okay, well, I'm gonna redesign that. How intriguing! Ooh, pink. Oh my goodness oh <gasps> this is so fun oh okay that one's kind of cute curious um, indeed ew no that no 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 <gasps> oh Ooh. it's ringed as well look at this nice long ringed wood <laughs> What are we doing here? How intriguing. I mean, really? These. Ugh. This just looks like a twig. Curious indeed. Ew. Uh, guys, what do you think about this one? I don't know. What do you guys think? How uh, intriguing. Is it... I just don't know. They all look a bit fleasy, like, what is this? Curious indeed. I'm in a chat about wood. Oh, guys, the options aren't very nice. But I kind of like this one, because it's white. I can't give any opinions about wood Jamaicans are watching. <laughs> uh, maple. 12 and a half inches. What about if it's small? How intriguing. Oh, God. How long? How am I meant to see the length? Swishy. What does that even mean? Shall I just leave it? Indeed. Oh. How a maple, twelve and a half inches, reasonable, reasonably supple. <sighs> the hair of a unicorn that serves as the core of a wand known for producing consistent magic. The feather of a phoenix that serves as the core of a wand capable of producing a great range of magic. Dragon heart string that serves as the core of the wand known for producing powerful magic. Should I do powerful magic then? Oh god, what? What are we doing here? Uh, natural grey, okay, I kind of like the fact that it's grey. <coughs> okay, I'm just gonna go with this one. A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Okay, I like that. I like that indeed. Oh, I need to click F. What do you think? <gasps> oh yes, it suits the outfit. Yes, cute. Hmm, I like it. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> <laughs> She's choosing wood type length and flexibility. Yes, because my wood. Now. No, you know what, guys? Stop. Good. No, pause. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. <laughs> Call me the, the wood handler. The seemed particularly <laughs> powerful. The right wand will learn from I you know to just as you it. learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. <laughs> I'm very experienced. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. <laughs> and the bond between you and your wand should I'm only grow stronger. I'm an wood handler. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability Pause. to perceive your intentions. Pause. Particularly in a moment of need. That Do you like it, Black? Well, clearly not. I picked white. I'll let you get to it. Do come and <laughs> I'm joking, see me again I'm joking, I'm joking. Oh my god. I can be of further assistance. I'm joking. Don't cancel me, guys. Please don't cancel me. I have no idea what he was saying. But. Toodles. <laughs> she speaks white, Gilly. <laughs> oh. Okay, so I need to visit Tom. Tomes and scrolls. Jay Pippins. 
Who what what else? Oh currently I can't remember what the last one was. Was it the sports one? Oh the magic neat. What the hell is that? Okay, it's this one. An inquiry. Hello. Mind. Hello, sir. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here, Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest. Creating something out of hey. nothing. Of course, oh, it is not in the complexity. game. Complexity. So Raheem's but in the game, and now Mari's in the game. Spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I too see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spell crafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Mm. Let's have a look. So Mari likes to grow his own ingredients. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Hmm. I'll be Mr. Brown, Raheem can be the other brother. <laughs> this is actually funny. So what do I need? I need these two. Potting table with a small pot spellcraft. Oh, I need to hold it. I keep forgetting I need to hold it down. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Sorry guys, eating my biscuits again. So I need to go to J Pippins and Magic Neep. J Pippins is there. What the hell is Magic Neep? What the fuck is that? Is it that one? Oh, okay, yeah. Um, okay, let's go to J Pippin. Uh, J Pippin, yep. Work hard and don't See, it's not stuttering as much. Oh. Yeah, it's not too bad now. Oh, God. Uh. And then it starts. Welcome to J. Pippin's <laughs> potions. Potions. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art to potion making? What do you mean by that? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. 
As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory, or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Bench of the dead. Ill. Leech juice. Ugh. Mongrel fur. Troll bogies. Oh, good God. Wigan Weld Potion. Is that the... He yeah, that's the healing one. Okay. So I'm going to be able to make more of that. Invisibility Potion. Focus Potion. Let's get out of here. We need to go to the other place now. Oh god, the stuttering. <laughs> well, hello there. Hello. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess, you're after something fresh. I wonder if he has giddy weed. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Well, that's everything. No, Better go doesn't. and find Sebastian. Alright. Let's go find Sebastian then. If I was in Hogwarts, I'm making Hogsley. <laughs> wow. Wow. Uh, you, you need some help, man. You, you need some help. Man said he would make lean. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, it's this way. Hey! Oh god, the stuttering is just ridiculous. Get me out! I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. Uh oh. What the hell is that? Is that a troll?
Oh shit! What? Wait, 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 wait. Control. Oh my god. Oh my god. I need to change that one. God. Oh, it's stuttering real bad. The starring. A taste of his own medicine. Oh shit. Okay. I need to change my button right now. Oh god. Too too oh, my fingers are too small. Okay, Zed. Oh good god. The stuttering is just tough. It's making it tough. That's right, you lumbering louts. He's faltering. A few more hits to do the job. What is he doing? He's actually doing nothing. He ain't really being helpful, is he? it to invoke a ancient magic okay you uh, why is it starring so much that's not good goodness a second troll did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves i suppose so it's all a bit of a blur to be honest merlin's beard are you all right we are and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, Officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you. Again. Merlin's beard is so moist. I know, they keep saying it. Merlin's beard. Like, what is this? I feel like I'm in Lord of the Rings or some shit. Prepare oh, uh, 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 a moment if you would. I'll go and see what you want. Oh, I think I'm too far away. Um Officer Singer to worry about. I think that's everything. Oh, 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 there's a sheep. There we go. Chest in there. <gasps> cats! Free cats! Oh my god! I know! Oh, it's sleeping. And we gotta greet the last one. Oh, 
look at them. Little babies. Yes. Oh. Revenia. Scriven shaft cuts. Was it outside? Oh, over there. Maybe it's in here actually. Wait, what's that? Uh. Okay. I don't think I can go in there. Oh, there's something here. Rebellion. As well. What's that? Oh, it's in Suede. What the hell was that? It's a cat, but it's wrapped up. Um, let's just hope it's a toy <laughs> and not an actual cat. Revelio. I think there's a sheet outside. Oh, there it is. Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And, as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Let's see. Give me a second. Uh, Look at the swag. <laughs> Look at the drip. Oh god. Ew. These clothes are just needy. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. Three broomsticks is just this way. I tell you, more battle worthy items, should you be inclined, you're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Oh, more gloves. How do you even open these? A 
Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? Unlike Victor Rookway. <laughs> all you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Anrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Mm -mm. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. <laughs> now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. It's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? I'm glad well he knows that he was useless. Thank you for this. <laughs> My pleasure. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <laughs> How timely. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Mm-hmm. Tell him. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? <laughs> I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Why? Ro and on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. Drama. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Hollow. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. You must return to your common room for the night. Access the map. 
select the Hogwarts map button to switch to the Hogwarts map. Complete side quest. Um, okay. I should speak with Lucan Battleby about the secret dueling club. I have to do this. You have received an owl post open field guide. Come and see me, I've discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. Okay. I think that's a main quest.
<laughs> oh my god, this is such a trick. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver! Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade, with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me, and he would have, had Serona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be <gasps> sure. But I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. The restricted section, to be precise. And a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Uh, the locket secret. What is that? On another adventure, are we? <laughs> Boy, can you help me? Man, Thought get out of here. <laughs> Werewolves, where were you? In the <gasps> rebellion of Cut. And by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. Oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling I'm lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Booth. Hello there. Perhaps you can help me. Okay, so we need to go to Professor Hecat. Ah. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell, handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, 
and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. Oh, God. You know where to find me once you've finished. Win two rounds of crossed ones. Complete a round of spell combination practice with Lucan. Ugh. Seems crossed ones isn't as secret as it's believed to be. If only a new student were to help me. Scenery is so nice. Revelia. Oh my god. Oh, not so Here I've come from the toilet bowl where she said I could swim. Did you practice a bowl? As long as we're only one time per week, I can plunge the boys' lavatory, not for the sea. Glad you could make it. Lucan's just over there. Revelio. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. <laughs> I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I seem to have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does cross ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining Damn. the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in crossed ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! <laughs> Love the enthusiasm. We'll make you regret signing up. Ew. Target lock. Let you track enemies without. Okay. Oh god. Light bark, no reaction. Oh, nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. In fact, the second jewel is ready when you are. 
And as a fully initiated member, you now have access to the official Crossed Ones training dummy. Very good way to master spell combinations. Come and see me and I'll set it up. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. Glad you're back. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Crossed Ones all set? Why, yes it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? I'll be dueling solo. Then let's get to it. Ready to get thrashed? Uh -oh. Apologies in advance. 1v3? God dang. Breakthrough Violet Shield with forceful spells like Summoning Charm, Akio. Okay. Akio is. Oh, oh. Akio is number four. So I'll get Light work, no reaction. Bravo! I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you. But after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. <laughs> You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning. Or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Complete a round of spell combination practice with Lucan. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all of your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay. Get you, You'll get it! Next time, perhaps! Oh, I need to do... okay. Yeah. I need to follow what is above. That's it. Ooh, okay, I didn't see that one. What is that one? Oh shit, oh shit. Oh no, okay, okay, I'm actually trash. <laughs> Why am I whiffing? Okay. I thought. Hold on a minute, I clicked. Okay, let's 
Yeah, I'm just gonna have to keep my fingers on the numbers then. I'd say that's <laughs> enough practice. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Assignment's all finished. I need to go back to the professor's office. It's going to be a long, long journey. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate- I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hecate. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say, I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that Fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. You have learned enough spells that you you'll need to equip Incendio to your spell set to do this. Okay. Good work. No, I'm not putting it. <laughs> uh, okay. Well. Drag to slot spell. Mm, I don't think I can even put it anywhere. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Maybe I have to remove one. I don't know. Feel free to practice in the classroom before you go. I've set up a few targets for you. Oh, I can only put it up there. Really? Oh, God. I'll put it here. Because I don't really need repair right now. Yeah, I can't use the other slots. 
I was so confused for a second. <laughs> What does she want me to do? Breh. Incendio. Return to Professor Fig's. Okay, now it shows up. <laughs> I'm so confused. Incendio, you're getting it. Keep at it. And do try not to incinerate yourself. Levioso. Accio. Numerous. I really do not need Numerous. Levioso. Accio. Incendio. Setting things ablaze is certainly cathartic, isn't it? student would help me with my sad predicament. Might some kind soul help me? Ah, there you are. Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Hecate. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig! I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your is... schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office, five minutes. Dang. You gonna let a man speak to you like that? That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor... We have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. So we are going to be starting from where we left off and we need to go to talk to Sebastian. <laughs> so cringe. <laughs> oh, I was going to jump over. What do I think this is? Apex or something? <laughs> Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. I'm not even- you know, let me open this chest real quick. Oh, I can't even unlock it. Oh, oh god, the stuttering. Guys, look at this. I just- how am I meant to walk? <laughs> Did I just go the wrong way? I wanted to go down. I think it's down. Yeah, it is down. I'm crying, that intro was so cute. <laughs> uh, it's because. Basically, earlier when I stopped streaming, I was like, it's kind of pointless posting like a three hour VOD. I may as well like compress two streams together so that it's at least like six, seven hours. Um, 
But yeah. She looks real uncomfortable, guys. Uh, she's literally avoiding eye contact. Hello? Girl, are you okay? Y you seem kind of nervous. You okay, ma'am? Ma'am. Oh. Look at her, just tapping away. Mm. I'm feeling this one. Okay. Oh. Excuse me? You don't. Uh, what was that look? <laughs> Sebastian, there you are. There you are. You promised me an explanation for what happened in the Three Broomsticks. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? It's to do with Renrock. Hmm. Seems he's working with Renrock. And Renrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Renrock? And when were you at Gringotts? Professor Fig and I ended up there after the dragon attack. It's quite the tale. Fig had this port key. A port key? To Gringotts? I'm not sure I follow. I barely follow myself, and I was there. Anyway, we ended up in an ancient vault where we found a map. That map leads to the restricted section. You can't be serious. Deadly serious. Professor Fig has insisted that I not tell a soul about any of this. I've probably said too much. That's what I'm saying, girl. Understood. You're just airing out your business. Your secret's safe with me. Whatever it is. Uh, Thank you, Sebastian. I don't trust him. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight. <laughs> and, tell and I no am. <laughs> this guy, man, he's unserious. He's unserious. And I am. <laughs> What is this? Oh my god. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. I don't know if he's trying to riz her up, but... There's some real whack-ass riz, you know? Sebastian wants... Uh, he definitely, he definitely wants it. See you there? That's the door we need to reach. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean... I'll actually be able to turn invisible. Something like Ooh. that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. Give it a Ooh. try. Meet Sebastian. Oh, 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 God, I'm not ready, I'm not ready. Oh, oh, God, I'm not ready, I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm not locked in. This illusionment. Use this illusionment to avoid being detected in off limited off limit areas. Sneak into the library. Um Maybe I need to use it first. Why can't I put them on here? Kind of annoying. Quietly now. Oh my god, guys, I'm invisible. Nearby adversaries will sense and then investigate suspicious behavior. Being caught by authority figures will result in, in quest failure. Oh my god, wait.
Oh no, I need that. Oh my god, I need that. Oh no, I don't have it. Oh, I switched it for this spell. I needed Accio. Oh no. Oh god, the stuttering is crazy. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay, maybe if it didn't start there, I would have been able to go down. Lord have mercy, how am I going to do this? Visibility is one of the only superpowers that would be useful IRL. True, that is very true. People would be able to get away with a lot of stuff. <sighs> okay. Silent as a grave. Blast. The librarian's still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. Oh, I was meant to go over there. Hee 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 hee. Me the librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, but it'll still be all right. Do you see her desk behind me? The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. I'll meet you outside of the restricted section. You distract, I get the key. Understood. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Trust me. Trust me. Get the key from the librarian's desk. Ooh, bah. Is she gonna go? Um, that's Is someone there. Okay. Is that you, Peeves? <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop. Oh my god, oh my god. The key! Here it is! Have I got it? I think I've got it. Yeah, I got it, I got it. Oh no, 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 she's coming, she's coming! <laughs> oh my god, what am I gonna do? Guys! Alright, that was a close one. Ooh. Blue leather gloves. That wasn't so difficult after all. Now, to find that book. Okay, um... Alright, we've got to be quiet and we've got to be sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> oh, that one's charm to look more useful than it is. It's fooled me twice. Never judge a tome by its cover, I say. Um... I guess we're going downstairs. Use basic cast while undetected to lure authority figures and enemies to a desired location. Aim mode grants precision spell targeting and reveals additional spell targets. Why Ghost, would I do it? Don't let her see you. Who? Don't let who see me. <gasps> oh, that ghost. Uh, guess I have to do it there. Sneaky, sneaky. Should be in the no need for us to be skulking about. 
Wait, there's someone down there. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne, so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do you think you'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? No. We've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mongo's. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you're after. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. Do they have anything inside? Secrets of the darkest arts. I'm impressed. Him or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. Now go. Good oh luck God. in your search. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? I know just the spell to repair this armor. Need to put it back. Repair it. Revelio. of ancient magic. There must be more to this room. Already got Lumos, okay. Mm. Bring the fire one just in case. Just in case it's dangerous. <laughs> Revelio. Okay, I got a hat. Where might this lead? Then again, we have like infrared technology, so maybe not. Yeah, that's true. The infrared would be able to see like your body heat. Unless the invisibility spell suppresses body heat as well. But who knows? Surprising. Guards at the ready. Oh. 
Oh shit! What's that? Your gift of an ancient magic accumulates by successfully attacking or taking damage. Successful 10 plus hit combos will begin generating ancient magic power ups. When at least one segment of your ancient maggot, maggot, <laughs> magic <laughs> meter is full, you can cast devastating ancient magic attacks. Tap X. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Hmm, great. Oh, I'm just flipping this guy, bro. Alright. Oh! oh. Holy shit! Oh! God, that scared me. How am I meant to get across then? Eh. What's this? What is that? What the hell is that? There's no way I can get across that. Oh, wee, run! Eee. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> I was not expecting it to bloody drop this must as I be crossed. The way forward, but to where? I think with this one I have to wait. I'm a bit scared. Or maybe I have to hit it again. Huh? 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 Best keep my wits about me. More glasses. <laughs> and another hat. And more people to fight. Revelio. No, no. Bun him up! Incendio. Okay, Incendio is not very powerful, is it? Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh! Oh god, oh god, oh god. This is actually kind of fun. I like this style of it combat. It is a book after all.
You wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I have never heard of another like us. Miss Morganock, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but it was certainly real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too, but we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganach. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. As such, we ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Okay, well, that was very interesting and educational. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? I wonder who his uncle is then. Is it the headmaster? Or is it someone else? Secrets of the restricted section. Okay. Where do I go now? How the hell do I get out of here? Goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay. Showed me the way now. What is this? Dusty Peeves! Oh my god. <laughs> Dusty for real, man. Big snitch. Oh, I think it's this... Is it this way? Yes, this way. I don't know why I don't just use the teleport. I need to start using them. That was a huge star. What the fuck? 
Um, let me see if I can use it. I can't be bothered to like bloody walk. Fig's classroom. Oh, shit. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Fair enough. <laughs> In fact, the book was below the restricted section, as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Dear, some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, Long day. I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? In the second, they were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Hmm, perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. I understand. It's sus. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spellcasting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. Well, on to the next quest. dueling metal and see if we've a new school champion meet me at the usual place for the final round of crossed ones <clears throat> also the training dummy is still available meet me in lower hogsfield as soon as possible i would like to talk to you about rookwood and harlow and it might be best to do so outside of the castle natty just sent you an hour post request okay I'm just gonna do that one.
Hamlets are small communities throughout the world. Okay. Um, as you explore, you will remove fog and reveal more of the map, unveiling new opportunities. Blah blah blah. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments Ugh. I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. Someone's popular today. Oh my god. Okay, so what's the main quest here? So the main quest is to meet the Natty. Okay, let's just do that. Hold on, what? Okay, I'm level 7, okay. I thought I was like too low of a level. Can I teleport? Oh my gosh, she's so far away. Maybe I can... Yeah, I'll go to that one and see if she's there. I think that's the right place. Is she here? God. No, I don't think she's here. Oh, she is? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. okay. We're on the right track. We're on the right track here. What the hell are these balloons? <laughs> Oh my god, that, look, that looks like Hagrid's hut. <laughs> this looks intriguing. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm all right at the moment. If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? Hmm, should I tell her? They want something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts. When were you at Gringotts? <laughs> Just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. A port key brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form of ancient oh, magic. Oh god, she's chatting I... too much. What does that mean? I'm still learning, but I can see traces of it. And I've cast magic I can't otherwise explain. I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. And I will have more questions. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack. And I shall never forget watching Serona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Okay. Good. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. 
And you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen and find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. Oh. Oh. Uh, I mean, I she just walked into me. <gasps> me. What's going on here? What is that? Oh god, more drama. Let's go be nosy and see what's happening. They must have come this way. Think. Uh oh. I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood, don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student? You can't be sick. <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupefy! Oh god, I'm gonna fight these brothers. Tell her who you want. What are you doing? Die for that. Oh shit. What is that? Oh, watch the light go out of your eyes. Oh, great. The collection section of your field guide has been updated with new enemy types. I'm not going anywhere. Oh, I'm not close enough to use in some video. Oh shit, that's the oh god, that's the woman. <laughs> Hard to see the grass just in my face. Okay, that sound effect was just crazy. <laughs> what the ah. just happened? I've oh never my been God. accosted in such a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. It's me. I'm Are the problem. Right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but <laughs> thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. Uh, research, how interesting. You're a researcher. Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specialising in Merlin's work and life. I thought that Merlin and the Tales about King Arthur's court were mere myth. Mere myth? <laughs> you lucky Sir myth. Duggan didn't hear you. <laughs> Chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? 
These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area, I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. Man said Merlin went to Hogwarts. Merlin. Man, man, be for fucking real. Be for fu so you're telling me Merlin is in this universe. All right, buddy. What's what's your source? Trust me. <laughs> oh my god. Remember that your effort today is the foundation for your success tomorrow. Slow progress is better than no progress. Same way slow motion is better than no motion. Is that the quote of the day? Is that the quote of the day? <laughs> Slap these man up. Quit yapping, Lauren and Game. No, hey, 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 hey. That is not me. I am not this this yappy old lady. Okay. Merlin is just a wizard. He's not locked to any universe. Listen, <laughs> he's not real. He's not real. What's <laughs> that, Merlin? Like, what is this? Merlin went to Hogwarts. Okay. Merlin went to. Uh, okay. Okay. I've heard it all now. <laughs> I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin oh, okay. repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. Merlin is real, you know. Okay. Um, did anyone ever see Merlin on CBBC? <laughs> I, I don't recall him going to Hogwarts. <laughs> That's actually crazy. Yeah. Merlin went to Hogwarts. <laughs> what? What are we doing here? What are we doing here? This trunk. Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the Mallow Suite. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the mallow suite on the swell, and we'll see what happens. Hmm. So we're going to put some leaves on, on the swell. <laughs> My word! Did you see that? The vines disappeared! What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these pyres. What now? Solve Merlin's trial. Oh. Um. Revelio. Hmm. Let me speak to. Oh, 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 I see that, I see that. Maybe I need, um, oh shit, wrong, wrong, wrong button. Um, not that button. <laughs> mm 
Maybe it's Akio then. Akio! Mm, okay. Rebellion. There's something here, bruh. Conjuring fire might work. These oh, are pyres after all. Incendio! Fallen's beard! The flames make the pyres sink. Merlin's beard. What Let me guess. Is that Merlin right there? Hardly believe it. I can see an outline or something. <laughs> speak to Nora. Okay, let's speak to her. I take it we can call that a success. We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require mallow suit, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must buy some. be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. So damn, I need to and get away from this bitch. Out here. Now I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. Revelio. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Not the suitcase hopping. The suitcase B hops. <laughs> oh my god, that. Yeah. I've seen it all now. Um, okay, I need to do the other stuff. I need to do my lesson, I think. Uh, herbology class, yes. I need to go and do my herbology class. Something in there, I just know it. She growing pungent onion again. Wow. So those are butterflies. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. Uh -huh. She seems sweet. Oh, hello. <laughs> class. Please welcome the newest rose in our garden. <laughs> we do look forward to growing together. How thrilling it is to have everyone back together oh again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing bone. Now then, 
Today, we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Aki. Oh my god. Wait, hold on. I remember this. When you pull it out, Let's see if we can't screams. make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect yep. our ears. <laughs> Here we go. Now, everyone, grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, God. Yeah, that is very bad. Yeah, this is worse than the movie. <laughs> The soil should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Repair it. That is such I'm a handy spell. Sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. I think she's on something else. <laughs> One of her own unique herbs. Now for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our pot. Hmm. I wonder if hippogriffs like not. Yes, pots. Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. I'll say. I nearly went deaf. Well, yes. Of course, the cry of a mature mandragora can be fatal. So remember to keep those ears protected. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Picked them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the magic neep. Wonderful. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. Wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Mifflers fancy, or roses? Ditany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Done. Once it can be harvested, your dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Bro, her name is Professor Garlic. Sort of flora, the Chinese <laughs> chopping cabbage. You'll find that some plants oh are better God. suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately. I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Who? Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. Oh, is he up there? Okay. Who the hell is... Hello. Who is Saw that? Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Oh, God. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll Can't be showing keep you the Chinese contact. chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But, your lead. Um, sir? I'm down here? You can't see me? You don't want to look at me? Am I that disgusting? Is it because I'm a rat? <laughs> nice work in defence against the dark arts, by the way. Oh, God, he's still Excuse talking. Me. Your duel with Sebastian! And he's good. Okay, buddy. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you are. Here we are. Home of the Chinese. Go on. Grab a few. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it. And they'll do the rest. Hold tab and tap to open the tool. Oh 
Oh god, shit. Look at that! Oh shit, that's not from anything they can get there. Man's getting mouths on. twanged by cabbage. Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the de gnoming, <laughs> but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. Booba kind of tubers and um, bouncing fun. bulbs. I'm not saying you can't go it alone. But All right. Well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. <laughs> it's chaos out there. Trolls in hogsmead and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Garden? <laughs> Take your time. All I'll right, see you buddy. back in class. I'm gonna leave you there. Oh, maybe I can collect this. reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves I, I? I attended to the Chinese chomping cabbages professor remarkable plants aren't they I hope they weren't too much trouble oh don't see any bite marks or missing digits and good as you do seem to be quite green fingered oh I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. That straight face. <laughs> no. Guys, did you see that straight face? Oh, I do enjoy checking in with my new students. <laughs> Like what? What? <laughs> New quest available. potions class or someone from the ministry guarding the school after the incident in Hogsmeade. Professor saw an aura badge on Professor Sharp's desk. I bet he knows more than he's letting on about the Goblin Rebellion. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. 
Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a wig and weld potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. This Use reminds a me. strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. This reminds me of the Half Blood Prince when they was making that love potion, and they just absolutely fumbled. <laughs> Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. <laughs> wow. Literally has no faith in me. Collect Ashwinder eggs, collect dark mongrel fur. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? Gareth Weasley? He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. He looks a bit like Sebastian. I'm Gareth, hell? by the way. <laughs> Gareth Weasley, bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Pleasure to meet you. Wait, are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adjurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fooper Feather, as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. Wow. I don't know, Gareth. I don't want to get on Sharp's bad side. You won't. Fooper Feathers aren't that valuable. Sharp won't even miss it. Man, get your I own damn feather. I have enough to worry about collecting the ingredients he wants me to get. I'm afraid I can't help you. I understand. I'll sort something else out. Man, get out of here, man. Boo. Your potion should not be that cold. Your potion stations organized. Should you chop the didney or crush it? The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate okay. Brew loss potions of your eyebrows. from unlocked recipes at the potion station. This is kind of like Genshin Impact. When you used to cook on Genshin Impact, it would like make you wait <laughs> for a certain amount of seconds. Okay. And now we add the mallow sweet and uh oh, 
That's odd. What's happening? Yeah, what is happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Dragon Dog! What happened? Well done, Gareth. Oh great. Thank you for that. Yeah. What now, Mr. Weasley. <laughs> This Sorry, whole Professor. this whole situation was a jump scare. From Bloody discombobulated again. guy. Yeah, good. You fucked up, buddy. You fucked up real bad. Look at your shit. It's turning green and shit. Get out of here, mate. TTV fan boozy, thank you for the follow. Thank you, I appreciate it. Um, okay, so I need to go to the professor. I brewed an Edoras potion as you asked, Professor. Glad you managed to stay on task. Not every class is so eventful. I saw Mr. Weasley speaking with you earlier. He can be quite persuasive. Glad you managed to resist. You've done well today. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Hmm. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Professor Shard must have learned a lot during his time as an aura. I wish he talked He's about an it. Aura? I was impressed that you were able to answer Professor Sharp's question about the Wiganwell potion. Oh! You're the new student. I've heard much about you. Um, thank you. I'm Amit, by the way. Uh, pleasure, truly. And I've never seen anyone brew such a flawless Wiganweld potion on their first try. Well done. I'm glad I was able to get it right the first time. You must simply have a knack for potion making. Some students seem so confounded by potion recipes, it's as if they're written in gobbledygook. A fascinating language, by the way. Neither here nor there, really, but I am a self-taught speaker. Merlin's beard, good conversation is the enemy oh of my free God. time. I must return my book, Gateway to the Far Stars. They before love my saying next class. Merlin's beard. Speaking of stars, we'll be in astronomy together. You'll love it. Professor Shaw is firm, but quite clever. See you soon, no doubt. Was that like the Greetings, phrase of the era? Slytherin. Scrope knows about the old book you found for Professor Feek. Scrope can help you. And... So we need to go to Scrope? Is that what we need to do now? Uh. Is it near the tr no, it's not near the trophy room. Maybe here. Oh god. Oh, I haven't unlocked it. Okay. I need to unlock those. Can help scrope. Get to the courtyard past the pendulum. If you don't know it, you'll see it easy enough. And don't tell anyone what you're up to. Especially Professor Black. How nice to see you, my young friend. Uh oh. Where did it go? <gasps> yeah. Oh no. Get it. I need to get it. Hold on. Oh my god. Urge defending Hogsmeade against trolls.
Oh, not there. <laughs> Revelio. Leviosa. I wonder why it's blue. Revelio. Guys, look how pretty it is. Look at the view. Crazy. Revelia. Scrope knows about that book you found. Is it missing something? Scrope does not believe it is safe to speak out in the open. Scrope has left another note across the bridge among the circle of rocks. Take care. Tell no one about this. Is that the little... Scrope? Who is Scrope? The little elf. Like, who is Scrope? Like, it has to be the elf, right? Like, the B-Tech Dobby. <laughs> we haven't even been here before. Or have Wait, we have. I don't remember coming here. Oh yes, that's how we met the girl. Um. Revelio. Let me open. Is it? Let me also. Oh, there it is. Maybe I have to bring it here. Okay. Let me bring the box here. Let go. How do you make it drop? Oh! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Almost there. Head for the pumpkins. Just down from the stone circle. Look inside one of them. You may be able to help poor broken hearted Scrope. Pumpkins? Oh, I think I know just the place. Wait, why is there another box? Look how she runs. Oh my god. She's a runner, she's a track star. <laughs> uh. Rebellion. Oh, there it is. In the pumpkin. <laughs> the young Slytherin must be exceptionally curious by now. Meet Scro uh, Scrope at the water's edge by the broken docks. Oh my god. Down to the water's edge. Bre hmm. This had better not be a trick. <gasps> oh, I could have dropped off. <laughs> I could have hurt myself real bad. <laughs> oh my god, there's another thingy here. Revelio. Is he in the in the little um crate? Oh. <coughs> Thank you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. I've been in the Black family for years. Oh my god. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Your notes mentioned the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help. But no one, especially the headmaster, can know. Happy to help, especially if you can shed light on the book. 
Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, may she rest in peace, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm sorry to hear that. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured black family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Scrope continues to honor her wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help. But when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the ring. <laughs> But man, man that drill. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. Tell me more about this treasured ring. Oh, it's adorned with the Black Family Crest. The headmaster would be pleased with Scrope for returning it. How did you injure your ear? The Blacks have a tradition of decapitating their house elves when their service is no longer required. Wow. One day, That's dear horrible. Apollonia was understandably frustrated with Scrope and got a bit too eager with a cleaver. <gasps> Scrope was able to convince the sweet girl of his value and now views this small injury as a reminder of her good heart. Oh my god, how cool. How did you know that I'd found a book? And what do you mean by that? I have no idea. Scrope and the other house elves you're gonna are have good to at ask staying him. out of sight. Scrope hears and sees many things in the castle. Scrope knows how to keep secrets. It seems this may help us both. I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast. Place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Oh, he's talking about the name. Oh, yeah, yeah. They're talking about the, the Blacks. You know, like, Sirius Black's family tree. Well, oh, this is basically his family, because this game is set in the 1800s. So, like, a lot of, like, the the families that we've seen in Harry Potter, like the Weasleys, the Blacks, um, some motherfuck motherfuckers there predecessors are in this game <laughs> all right so i need to go to the grotto wait where the hell is the grotto hold on hold on okay i think i'm going the right way Huh? 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 <gasps> oh my- Oh my god! I did not see that motherfucker! Oh my god. Okay. Well, now I know that he's there. <laughs> oh my goodness. The hell he blended in so well. Turn back, you're done. I know. I didn't even have time to like put up a shield. Like he just, he just went straight at me. I thought I could just, you know, cross the water peacefully. I thought the water was harming me. <laughs> All right. Well, let's get his ass. Can't be doing that to me. See, look, I can't even see him. Where the hell? Okay, there he is. Yeah, fuck you, bitch. Oh, I can't even. Okay, I can't make him float. Great. <laughs> Brother got lifted. <laughs> no way. What is that? That looks like shite. Dog bog 
tongue. Ugh. I literally thought that was like a pile of shit. Is that another one? Oh, great. I can't bring them to me. Oh, God. Hey, 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 Oh! Oh my god, they got that new long last time, bro. No, get away from me, guys. Doing too much. Oh god, I need, I need a break. Ah! I can't do it. No, 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 no. I need to lock in. I need to lock in. I'm sorry, guys. These just threw me off completely. Okay, so I can't. I can't. Fight them up close. I need to keep my distance. Great. Um, the hell is this? Okay. Shit! Ah! They're so powerful, what the f- Oh! Oh my god, I think I need to heal. I'm just gonna stay up here. I don't think they can get me from up here. Ah! Oh my god, this is taking forever. I'm gonna need to get a bit closer. This one is down here. Incendio. Why does it keep hitting that one? Oh, flip it on his back. How do I flip it on his back? Oh, shit. Um, no. no, 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 relax, relax, relax. Uh, oh, oh, God, this is ridiculous. Uh, how the hell am I meant to flip it on its back? Hold on, hold on, hold on, what? I can't even use Accio, bruv. No, I need to think, I need to think, hold on. This, I need immense brain power right now. Okay, equipping better gear. Oh, bitch! I was trying to read that. Maybe I'm gonna have to use the cabbages. <laughs> Maybe, you know, that's what we're gonna do here. Yeah. yeah, you come over here, bitch. No easy way. Flip a dog bog onto its back. Okay, my health is better now. Oh my god, I need I need Hold on a damn minute. Uh, levitate objects. Uh. Hold on, no, 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 I need it. Okay. Maybe we could do Levioso and then. Maybe it's number two then. Wait. Okay. It didn't work. Okay. 
now number four. Oh god. I'm gonna have to Google this real quick. Um, it doesn't work when I'm too far away. <laughs> this is a bit confusing. I don't think I've done this combo. That's great. It doesn't really work. <laughs> Let's try it on this one. Um, okay, great. Great, great. Okay, I'm gonna Google it real quick and see how I can flip it on its back because. How to flip a dog book onto its back? So Accio. Defindo? I don't have Defindo though. Bitch! <laughs> Just run past them. I could try that. I don't think I have the <laughs> the resources. Oh! Oh, thank God. See, this is why we need Raheem. I was thinking, bro, I ain't got no damn spell for that. Maybe I should have just used invisibility. Why would I need a piece of toast? Huh? I suppose that's toast. where it goes. The hell? Could it be a visitor? Uh oh. Why is he? What, what? Hang on a minute. <laughs> I'm just. Oh! Ooh. Great. <laughs> ah! <laughs> the name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student just like you about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Sorry to say, I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. I'd like to have those pages if you don't mind. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happened next. <laughs> Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest uh -oh. and I'll show you where to find the pages. I think I can guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look around when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze. After that, I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Oh Hence, if you do visit the cave, be prepared. 
I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. I, I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, oh, hell they're no. yours for the taking. Oh, great. So we're going to dig up a grave. Is that what we're going to do? Oh my goodness, can you swim? I'm gonna do I maybe I should just <laughs> make myself invisible. <laughs> maybe that'll work. Oh, so the water removes it. Oh my god, get the hill away from me. Scrope, thanks to you I was able to enter Apollina's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. Scrope's last hope. Okay. What is that? Revelio. Levioso. I wonder what that is. I need to learn the disarming charm before I can follow Richard Jackdaw. I'm so nosy, I just want to know what this is. Okay, I give up. Get off! Hold on, let me give it one more go. something with that later. I was not going to walk all that distance. <laughs> that was long. Long, long, long. Oh. 
<laughs> I mean, all right then. Hmm, I thought I'd do that. I need to learn the disarming charm. So where, where do I learn that then? Let's see if I can learn it here. Maybe it's in the... Sorry, I was just drinking my water, hold on. <laughs> Maybe it's in the um, side quests. Maybe I have to do these first. <laughs> Expelliarmus, yes, that one. Expelliarmus. I see over there. Breh. <laughs> Professor Heeker wants me to practice avoiding attacks by dodge rolling. She also wants me to cast incendio on a few enemies. 
but my map could still prove useful. Okay. Guess we have to follow that um path regardless. Might some kind soul help me? Girl, go help yourself. This is taking me to the right place. Oh. Oh my god, this is far. I swear, if it takes me to that place again, I'm gonna fucking cry. <laughs> um, where do I? Okay. I couldn't agree more. Where is it taking me, bro? This shit discombobulated. Where is it taking me? Very confused. Okay. I'd like to see your parents' faces. Is that do I really have to travel all this way? Look, targets in effective tool. Okay. Guys, I'm kind of just freestyling right now. Literally. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Hello. Confusing. Maybe I. Maybe. Okay. Maybe I'm not meant to be here. I don't know. <laughs> We're just gonna have to see. What the hell was that? 
Right. Oh, God. Ah, oh, didn't dodge. Fuck. I need to check. Wait, 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 wait a damn minute. I need to change my button to dodge, seriously. Let me change it. <gasps> oh my god. Change that shit real quick. Do five more. Four more. Come at me, bro. Okay, cast incendio on enemies. Hey! Stop it! Oh my god! I'm just a girl. I'm just a school girl. What are you doing? Oh my god, no, get away from me. Seriously? I need some space. This is what's out in ring. Incendio! Oh my god, the fucking bullshit. Oh, right. Okay, closer. Oh, you son of a bitch. I'm trying to press him through. Oh god, I'm about to die. Oh my god, I'm gonna die for real. I just need four more! Get the hell away from me, you stupid dog! Oh my god, this is tough. God. No way, no easy way, no way. Get, get, get away! Jump! Jump! Oh my god, you midget! Please, please stop, stop, stop. Stop, 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 stop. I'm literally zero HP. <laughs> what the fuck? I wasn't close enough. Avoiding our problems, are we? Alright, I need to do uh three more. Three more. Okay. No! Yeah, you did, man. Oh shit. I need to do one more. One more. Yes. All right, we've done it. Attend defense against the dark arts class during the day. Okay. Oh god, I'm so sorry, guys. I was not expecting that. All right, let me go back to the class. <laughs> After putting my myself through that. Um, Leroy, have you got Avada Kedavra yet? No, I actually don't. Let me show you. It actually is a spell on this game that I can use. That's crazy.
they got Crucio as well. Um, Imperio. They jumped you in the forest. Yeah, it's me, man. I'm meant to be doing um, this quest, but I needed to learn a spell first before I could actually go and do it. Uh, what's it called? Uh, Expelliarmus, I think it is. Now I need to go to the Claws, wherever that is. Uh, attend defense against the Dark Arts class during the day. Yeah, okay. Oh, wrong button again. <laughs> okay. I think it's this one, isn't it? It's okay, guys. Sometimes you fumble. But as long as you get back up, that's all that matters. <laughs> Never back down. <laughs> Never give up. I've Even if you get jumped in the forest. The mind. Okay. Ma'am, I'm here to learn. Expelliarmus! These students hard at work. <laughs> the last, the last girl just side-eyed the teacher. So dirty. Return to Professor Huka. I hope you were able to take care, Professor. I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. You seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Spellyarmus may save your life someday. Revelio. Oh, wrong button. Expelliarmus. Still at it, I see. Accio. Levioso. Accio. Professor, do you have a moment? I do. What is it? I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well... They seem to get more capable every year. Although, we got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigellus Black for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. I... I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were... uh... students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. Time itself? I never would have imagined such a thing. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Ah, 
As you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. Now, I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Keep up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. Is that her excuse for looking old? <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, but I sacrificed my sub to you to resub to Jeremy. That's okay. It is what it is. Okay, now we can do the main quest. Nope. Do you know what? I want to change this quickly. Hold on. I don't really need this. Um... I'll put this one here and then this one here. And that should be good. Whatever. I want to fly. That's what I want to do. I wonder if I have to go over there myself. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, it's literally like going in the same direction. Oh my god, chill out. <laughs> Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It took the cunning of a Slytherin to track down these pages. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks, a stone bridge, oh my God, what a the animals do? <laughs> and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. 
Shout out Bambi. <laughs> yeah, Bambi's just lurking. Hmm. Yes. Lurking in the forest. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Uh oh. Probably best I leave you to it. Yeah. Simply stick to the what path do you mean? and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. So he's just gonna and leave me Oh my god, really? Is that Latin? Or Greek? Oh my god, hmm. so he's gonna he's just leaving me to do it by myself. Nothing to do now but keep going. I really don't want to see any spiders. Because that would just make me feel very icky. Uh, oh! Don't want to drop. The waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. That. What's that? <gasps> they look cute. Wait, what is that? <gasps> so cute. Come back. Hello. Puff scheme. No, come back. Oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. Is this the same like lake? Wait, is this a lake or river? Whatever. This is this the same area as in Harry Potter when like is. serious Just black was on the floor described. and the mentor just sucking out his soul. Intramuros. Renrod Skinny can eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jackdaw has led me. Okay. The shield really reminds me of when I was playing Kana. Is it she the same button as well? And like the counter attack is the how same. Big this place is. Revelio. Oh. These rooms must have something to do with opening this door. I can shoot the symbol, but it doesn't stay lit for long. Impressive. That must be where 
this one leads. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. Revelio. Ew. Oh, I wonder the spider. If my spells will help Ew. me through this. Incendio. Ew, ew, ew. No, 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 no. No! Oh, oh. No, this is making my skin cool. Ah, y'all need to get gut. Get out of here, man. Y'all need to get gut. Woo! I'm bun up myself. That's making me like feel like really sick. <laughs> Guys, if you don't know, I have arachnophobia and yeah, spiders just make me feel really disgusting. <laughs> if I could summon that platform to me, I could likely get on it. Um. Oh, 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 sorry. Oh, oh, oh. Where are we going? Maybe we have to go over there. Let me open. Let me open. Oh. Oh, oh god. Okay. Great. Maybe we have to take it over there or something. <laughs> Nah, get out of here. The jackal can solve this. So nice. Let's see what that is. Oh, it's another door. Wait, is that the same door? Or is it a new door? Spider fang. Perhaps the next symbol is hidden somewhere. Revelio. Is that <laughs> actually? Mm. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I go on. Oh, my God. How do I get it over there? Oh, okay. It's 
kind of interesting. Wagwan Witch. Wow. Wow. Hello, hello, I Nathan. A chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. What the hell is that noise? Oh, no, that's scaring me. Huh? Sounds like he's saying shit. <laughs> nah, brother. <laughs> that's actually scaring me. Um, I don't want to see no more spiders. Please. <laughs> oh, shit. Why does your character sound? Oh! oh, hell no! They're all dead now. Um, why does your character sound like some Tory inside, witch? But I <laughs> may as well help myself to this. I don't know. Revelio. This just sounded ass. She does sound a bit posh, but um, the game is set in the 1800s, so they would have been speaking like this anyways. Now I came through here. Okay. What's under there? Looks a bit disgusting. Uh, more spiders, grey. I'm not going to touch those. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh, there's too many. Just go. Listen, I just want to open the chest. Just want to open the chest if I can. Maybe I actually have to. Oh! Get rid of these now. I don't think it's gonna open. Great. Right. Let me just get out of here. Hermione still clears you? Wow! I'm Hermione Granger! And you are... <laughs> You've got dirt on your nose! <laughs> Did you know? Alright, we've got loads of spider fang. Um... Ugh. 
Revelio. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. I literally said that earlier in my first stream. <laughs> oh my god, wait, wait, wait. What's the one that's trending? Hold on, what is it? Um, what is it? When they were playing chess and it was like, I think it was in the, the, the second one? Um... It's Ron, Harry, and Hermione, and they're like on the chessboard, yeah. And they're like, <laughs> "What is it? He's going to sacrifice. No. <laughs> He's going to sacrifice himself. No, you can't. There must be another way." <laughs> Look, you want to stop Snape from getting that stone or not, Harry? It's you that has to go on. I know it. Not me. Not Hermione. You! <laughs> no, 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 I need to touch grass. I need to touch grass, that's what I need to do. Because why, why do I know this stuff? <laughs> I need to touch grass. Oh my god. Fawn back. Oh my, no, that's disgusting. Oh my god. Hell nah. What in the hell do you exist this? Listen, I remember it was trending on TikTok. Because this woman like reenacted it and it was just so fucking funny. Ew. Ew. Where the hell are these damn pages? Bavelio. Oh, so there's more spiders. Fall down there. More spiders, great. Um. This is so much like Kana. Oh, we have to go over there. Okay. Um. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? No, my gear. Hold on. My gear slot. Ooh. Okay, I'm just going to stick with the black gloves. Ew. No, that, that. <laughs> Hell no, I need to sell that. Get that out of my in inventory. Get it out. So how can I empty it? Can I just like drop drop the stuff or I'm probably just gonna have to sell it. What? The hell keeps making that noise? Why is that noise? Guys, that's scaring me. God. Bun up. Get bun up. Oh shit, I need it. <laughs> Too much. <gasps> Run. Incendio. 
Whoa, I just bun up myself again. I forgot I can dodge. Oh my god. Listen. Just get out my way, please. Leave me alone. I don't want to die. That's all. Oh shit! I'd have thought Chapdoor would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Is that an eyebrow slit? It's a scar. You can't see. It's a scar. I wanted it to look a bit like my eyebrow, because I actually have a scar on my eyebrow that has formed a slit on my eyebrow. Um, where do I need to go? Potato, <laughs> nah, you got an eyebrow slit here. No, I don't. I was naturally given the slit. I don't need to force it, you know. I'm joking. When I was younger, um, I bust my there eyebrow. Now I got a scar on it. Complete. Oh, More spiders! Ah. These can't be what beheaded Richard did. Fuck off! Oh my god, this is too damn much. How about, why don't I just, just avoid them completely? How do I get through here? Stupefy. Oh, the fuck in the elder room. Bring that bitch to me. Leg. Guys, did you see the leg? <laughs> what the hell, bro? Oh! Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Way too many. Oh my god. If they're just coming out of the ground like that, I'm actually gonna die. Maybe I have to go on the ground. What's this? No, 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 no. Oh my god, there's a thing underneath. Okay. There's a thing underneath, guys. I think I need to hit that. Um, Let the spider bite you. Maybe get powers. <laughs> Listen, this ain't, this ain't the spider man. Okay. Peck him, girl. Oh my god. Please, I don't associate me with those ends. Thank you very much. Don't do it. Is this the right place? Am I going the right way? Oh, I'm back here, okay. Oh god. Need to go down there. There it is. The bridge. It's almost oh. complete. More spiders. These can't be what the head of Richard Jackson. Oh shit! Oh my god. Has it opened it? Please. Oh, 
Oh my god. Yeah. Shame you're so foul. Oh, that is actually ugly. That's so scary as well. Um, hello? Oh! No easy way. Oh my god! The fucking one from the ground just fucking got me. Oh, uh, I think. I need more healing potions, that's what I need. That is what I need. Equipping better gear with higher stats will help you fight. Don't have better gear. What do you want me to wear? Oh, that has zero defense. Okay, maybe I should wear it. <laughs> um, 17. 18. Look at this drip. I know it's not good. Offense 23. How do you increase your health bar in this game? So I'm just gonna have to wear all my clothes. <laughs> Even a hat. An ugly ass hat. What is this? Is this how I have to look to fucking defeat these motherfuckers? The skirt is giving kill. That's what I'm saying. Like, it's giving Scottish aesthetic. Do you know what I mean? Look at this. What is this? No, be for fucking real. Come on now. The hat's wavy. No, you're lying. Nathan, you're lying. Come on. <laughs> what are we doing here? Alright, let's try with the clothes. <laughs> I doubt it's going to make much of a difference, but... There it is. Uh, Rich, it's almost complete. More spiders. These can't be what the head of the... Oh, oh, God, I need to start dodging. This is what I'm saying, I can't. Leave me alone, sir. Oh, the ones in the ground, they're really just doing too much. Oh, great, now I'm like my fault here, a two HP. Oh! Okay. Please, I don't want to die. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh! Oh, I'm a gonna. Do you know what? I might need to just go back to the potions class. And make some more health potion because i have nothing so i can't even like heal myself in between um here i am as good oh as my gosh. word shut your ass up <sighs> okay that's long this is long <laughs> I want to see the map. 
Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to make some more potions. Because this is an absolute howler if we don't. But I don't remember where it is. Oh, wait. What's that? And Thank you, Mathematics, for the follow. Thank you. Oopsie, what is bottom do? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean by that? Oh. I need potions. Uh, it's a joke. Damn. That's crazy. Where's the potions? <laughs> uh, I'm like blind. I'm actually blind. Oh, there it is. Oh my god, so blind. Well, it's a good thing that you followed me. Because I can be quite entertaining. How are you? I'm alright. I'm a bit tired and a bit hungry. How are you? A little owly told me that you might like Harry Potter. Well, yeah, I do. I do indeed. Like Harry Potter. Have you played this game? Everything is awesome. Good, good. Now, That's nice to hear. Where's it? Wait, hold on. Yep, I'm playing as Ravenclaw. Oh no. Mm -mm. We don't do Ravenclaw around here. <laughs> Just Team Slytherin. The Slytherin gang, mate. I'm joking, joking. Um, did you actually want to get into Ravenclaw or was it like just given to you? Um. Okay, I need to think. Hold on. I, I was probably literally right in front of the fucking classroom. I should have just went in. I need to lock in, guys. I'm literally underperforming right now. That's the classroom, isn't it? My god. Yep. My test called me a Gryffindor. Definitely a bug. <laughs> I'm scared of my own shadow. <laughs> no! Oh my god. I remember when I played like a little bit in February, I got put in Gryffindor as well, but I had to change that <laughs> effective immediately. Um, but this time around, I got put in Slytherin straight away. I need some more of this shit right now. I mean, if Harry Potter can choose a house, then so can I. True. That is very true. He was like, not Slytherin. Not Slytherin. Uh, I need some Dittany leaves. Oh, God. <laughs> this is so long. I believe Herbology is down here. Yes. Greenhouse. Let's see if my plants are ready. My ex girlfriend is a Slytherin as well. She is also rooting for the Empire and is a big Loki fan, so you can see the button. <laughs> Oh my god, yeah. Loki, yeah, he would, if he was in Harry Potter, he would definitely be in Slytherin, for sure, without a doubt. I think four, four would be in Gryffindor, 
And Loki would be in Slytherin. Oh yes, my plant is ready. There's more in nine minutes. There's loads here. Okay, I can't take it. <laughs> I wanted to steal some. No one, me, the Ninja Turtles, personalities, perfect lineups with the Hogwarts houses. Yep. You know, that's actually true, you know. They each, like, kind of represent each of the Hogwarts houses. <laughs> My god. What are we doing here? Um, Potions classroom, okay. <laughs> the spiders are just... They're just doing too much. I love being here. You are kind to me. Oh, thank you. Thank you for being here. Even if you accidentally followed. <laughs> it's all good, man. Good vibes here. I need some more of that freaking... Oh. Can't I just buy this in like Hogsmeade or something? It wasn't actually an accident, I was joking as if I did. Oh! Well, I appreciate the follow. I appreciate it, May. Lauren, just use some bug spray on the spine. <laughs> Listen, if bug spray was a fucking spell, then sure. Or a slipper, wow. Listen, I don't think my feet are big enough to squish one of those motherfuckers, but one can dream. Um, yes, you can buy the potions on Hogsmeade. Those spiders are a bit too huge for those. Oh my god. I'm gonna need more um more health for sure. Potions. Oh I don't wanna walk. Uh, okay, I can use that. Yes. Yes. I keep forgetting about the teleports. Also, does your game stutter as well? Like, my game stutters so much. Indeed, your field guide. It never I'm used to be like that, to be but now it's just really bad. I need that page. Oh my god, see, it's stuttering. <laughs> Always in Hogsmeade as well, or just like when I run or when I like do combat. Now, this is the only game I've ever known to do this on my PC. We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. What can well, I can do you for you today? Give me some fucking health, mate. Uh, oh, three. Okay, that's good. A wise to... decision. Thank you. I'll take all of that. <laughs> I hope to see you again. Thanks for being Farewell nice for to me. Now. This is why I'm a console player. Bro, uh, I don't know if you're male or female. Actually, you said ex-girlfriend, maybe. I don't know, whatever. But, yeah, bro. Um, Listen. 
this game. It's just giving me a headache. Every time it stutters, it's just... Like, why? Why? I looked on Reddit as well. And, um... Quite a lot of people are having this issue on PC. Um, but not console players. Like, apparently on console it's really nice and smooth. Everything's good. But on PC, oh my god. It's actually a struggle. I don't want people thinking, oh yeah, her stream is like really laggy. It's like, no, it's not me. I see this shop vendor and think 40 <laughs> Same about Jedi Survivor. What is it? Is it okay on console and bad on PC? Hold on, I didn't even check how much health I have. Okay, I got six. That that is beautiful. That is a figure that I want to see. Um, now I need to go back to that guy. Oh, no. no. Exactly, PC is borderline unplayable. I just don't know why they do that. Like, I don't know why they release games when they know that it's not at its full potential. It's, it's just like such a scam. Like, they just they just want the money. They just want people to buy the game so they can get money. And it's like, you haven't even, like, fucking fixed the bugs or anything like that. Like, because I was looking on YouTube earlier. Um... And, like, this issue has been going on for, like, nine months. Like, bro, come on now. You can't see the complaints? You need to do something, man. Do something about it. Because it is actually a good game. Like, I'm actually enjoying it. But it just makes it so hard to play because it's stuttering so much. And even people with, like, really high uh, PC specs, even they're struggling. PlayStation for life. You know what? I do love a PlayStation. I have an Xbox right now. Um, but I only got it because at the time, like back in 2019, I wasn't making as much money. And PlayStations were quite expensive. So I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna get an Xbox. <laughs> just hope for the best. I have three consoles. Damn. Or is it like PlayStation, Nintendo, Xbox or something. <laughs> exactly. Getting all three along with a VR set is still cheaper than a PC. Yeah, that's true. But I think it just depends, like... I think it's good to have a PC if you know you're gonna, like, do streaming or content creation, because obviously... It's very versatile, like, you can use a PC for a lot of different things, like editing your videos, watching stuff, playing games, doing work, whatever. So it comes in handy. Um, But, yeah. Oh, I can't stream. My face is too ugly. Oh, my God. <laughs> I mean, it's okay. I am a rat. Too. Yeah. I'm joking, though. You probably look fine. It doesn't matter, honestly. Here it really doesn't matter. As good as my word. You don't even need to show your face sometimes. You can just be a... Do, like... PNG... VR, I think it's called VR, whatever it is. Um, yeah, those kind of streamers that don't show their face. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It took the cunning of a Slytherin to track down these pages. Well said. Now, where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a bird bath. When you find it, say Intramuros. I think it's Latin. As All you can right. imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Oh, so I have to fight them spiders again. Oh my god. Uh, 
Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm, yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. I use my PC for management games like Sims, Cities, Skylines, Jurassic World, Evolution, you get me. Oh, okay. Nothing to do now but Do you play any FPS games or anything like that? Leroy, you're not a rat. Look at your Twitch profile picture. <laughs> Listen, hey, it's just filter, okay? It's just filter. <laughs> The waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. Yes, but those I do on console. Ah, oh, okay. Makes sense. Oh god. Besides Battlefield 2042, place. it's old enough to work Such perfectly on my PC. Creatures, stags. Oh god, why are you talking about the stags? <laughs> there it is, just okay. as Jackdaw described. I'm pretty sure there were some nice things that pop out here. Intramuros. Is there a fire spell in this game? Yeah. So, number three is my uh, fire spell. Um, where is it? It's called Incendio. But it's quite short range, so it can be a bit annoying to use. <laughs> Especially when you miss. And then you have to wait for it to like charge up again. Oh god, here we go. Aren't you a little <laughs> far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. <laughs> Oh shit. Report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jackdaw has led me. Um, I'm begging you use it while shouting fire for that. What the hell? Where's this going? No, no, I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Oh, as you get cancelled, people will give me a side eye. Nathan will side eye me. I wonder how big this place is. I actually need those. I think. Yes. Let's try complete this. Incendio. I wonder if any oh of my God. spells will help me this. Rebellio. Incendio. Stupid one. Incendio. 
What would be your reaction if you got your Hogwarts out? What, in real life? Bro, I'm black. You know what? I knew I was gifted. I knew I was special. Annihilated. <laughs> that ancient magic. Huff. As for myself, well, I can't imagine a place that would be scarier for me than Hogwarts. <laughs> I don't know, like... What's scary about it? Like, why, why would you be scared about it? Is it because it's like creepy and like there's just so much drama oh shit if i did i would learn oh my god xeno really Forget the drama, let's start with moving stairs across seven floors. Oh my god, literally, like, I've always wondered, like, what if, like, you're trying to get to the common room or your lesson and the fucking stairs just move or you're trying to go to the toilet or you're drunk, like, what? And, like, how long does it, like, stay in that one place before it, like, rotates and turns? Because that would just piss me off. Like, imagine, like, you're having a bad day, you're late for your class, and you're trying to go up the stairs, and it fucking switches to the other direction, and you're just like, oh, for fuck's sake, you know what? Fuck this shit. <laughs> that would be, like, that 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 would just send me over the edge, I think. <laughs> that would literally send me over the edge. I mean, I'm scared of heights, which bring me to the next point, flying class. Oh, my God. You know, I think I'd have fun with that. I don't mind that. I don't mind. Um, obviously, I wouldn't want to fall off my broom and uh, brack my back or my legs. But hey, it's a fast form of transport, you know. No more buses, trains. Just just hop on a broom and fly the fuck out of here. The ads have smacked me in the face. Damn. Well, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, may. Isn't their student casualty rate like super high? Yeah, the Quidditch, Quidditch games. I remember what Harry fell off his broom. How did he not die? Oh yeah. Fucking, what's, what's his name? Dumbledore. I think Dumbledore stopped him from dropping onto the floor. And basically discombobulating himself. If by high you mean one then yes all others were kicked by Voldy <laughs> killed by Voldy yep gotta deal with Voldemort it's alright man just gotta be a powerful wizard just win that's all you <laughs> when you when you fight them you're just gonna say you know what just win just win <laughs> because he's Harry Harry Potter is a mortal trust um yeah, I didn't. I don't. I didn't know this was Vampire Diaries. You know, Harry Potter is immortal. It's just a immortal being. Yeah. And here is the next point on my fears: 
just hear the spiders oh my god yes you know i can't lie this is disgusting for me like when i first saw them ugh, it just made me cringe really hard because i actually have arachnophobia but obviously it's not real but if it was real oh my god oh my god i'm literally like ron weasley a fucking pussy -o when it comes to spiders <laughs> i would not be in the forbidden forest i'm telling you now i'm telling you now I'm not, i would not nah keep me far away Keep me far away. Whew, it's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down Of there. course, those are the small- Yeah, those are the small ones. That's the crazy thing. Those are the small ones. <laughs> oh my god. What's his name? What's the big spider's name? Ugh, and Hagrid was like crying over the fucking spider. Bro, I would not be crying. I'd be like, yes, thank god it's gone. Goodbye, GG's. Get out of here, mate. <laughs> Imagine being scared of spiders, just step on them. Well I'm sorry Nathan, they just they just make me cringe, okay? Oh shit. Oh that fucking one on the floor. Oh get up, get up, get up. You know I need to keep my distance here. And just not fight them. That's what I need to do. Just don't fight them. Irrelevant. There it is. The bridge. It's almost complete. Oh. More spiders. These can't be what the head of it is. Incendio. Tega. Stupid one. Stupid one. Oh shit. Oh god, wait, hold on. What is my heal? <laughs> I'm getting fucked up right now. is the tough bit. <laughs> Shit! Bro, this is tough. No! Oh my god, that thing almost nabbed me, man. Yeah! Oh my god! Oh god! Gee! Oh my god, fuck off, man! Seriously, what the fuck up, girl? Oh god, this is. this is annoying. Listen, I can't catch a break right now. <sighs> run! 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 Oh my god, oh my god, how did I dodge that? Oh, the fucking little ones! Oh god. <laughs> oh! Oh my god! I just wanna go. I don't wanna fight no more. Leave me alone. Oh, ah! Stop it! Oh my god. How do you do this bit, honestly? It's like fucking long. Oh my god, there's more! Shit. Oh my fucking days. 
I'm not gonna make it. I'm literally not gonna make it. How the hell do I do this? How does one do this? Man, these spiders are on to you, bro. I've never seen such committed spiders. I don't even have any nails in there. I literally can't do this. Oh my god! Find the missing bitch! I can't even defeat these spiders! Oh shit. God, is this it? Oh, no more. Please, no more. Oh God, this is so painful. It's like mentally painful. Son of a bitch. Honestly. No, how do I do this? <laughs> how do I do this, guys? How do I do this? Does anyone know how the fuck I do this? Do I actually need to fight them? Because this is actually impossible. Google, I'm gonna use Google right now. Um, Okay, we might be here for a little while. We might be here for a little while. Whew, it's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. Oh, God, look, I've got six six hills again, thank God. Thank you. Yeah. Um. Okay, just ignore, oh. <laughs> Oh my god, it touched me! Okay, we're not gonna bother fighting these ones. There it is. Defeat all the enemies Bridge. however you it's choose. Complete. Okay, but... These can't be what the hell is this Move, Kurt! Take her! Oh my god, no, stop, stop. This is skipsing. <laughs> Let me open. Accio. Incendio. I'm actually fumbling real hard right now. I 
don't know why it doesn't work. Maybe I actually have to defeat I'll them. I need to look around for the Fuck. Oh, the one behind me. Eight legs is simply too many. <sighs> this actually is a howler. I agree, Nathan. This is a big fucking howler. Should ignore the little ones. Yeah. Ah! No, blood cart way. Get me out of here. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead. Oh, the fucking one's underneath! Oh my god. Oh, fuck off, man. No! Oh my god, I can't do this! I'm gone, I actually gone. How, how many attempts is this gonna take? <laughs> This is actually annoying. Uh, there it is. The bridge. It's almost complete. More spiders. These can't be what the hell is Richard Jack. There's way too many. Oh shit, it hit me. Ah! Crap. I need that. I need that. Oh, it's in the ground. It's in the ground. I need to stop it from going underground. There's a victory that came none too soon. Oh, God. God. Oh, it's underground, it's underground! Oh my god, I need distance, that's what I need. Keep the distance. Ah! No way! No fucking way! <laughs> oh my fucking days! This is like the one level when you play. Oh, I can't! I can't! I can't! I'm actually getting stressed. <laughs> this is like the one level when you played K9. Yes, it is, and it's fucking terrible. I might have to switch this to easy because <laughs> this is a hell. There's no easy way. There's no easy way. There it is. The bridge. Mm -mm. It's almost complete. 
More spiders. Oh shit, I wasn't even paying attention. I'm trying to get this one. Oh my god. What the hell? Ah! Oh my god, stop! Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh my god, let leave me alone, please. Leave me alone. Oh my god. Oh shit. Come on, like one HP, bro. I need my combos so that I can um, use the ancient so magic. That's what I need. Maybe I should get rid of the- ah! Doesn't the fucking thing work? I don't understand. I can't unblock it with my shield. Oh my god, bro. You're just making it fucking hard. I don't even have like, anything. I don't fucking have health. Oh, this is trash. I think I can only, um... Oh! Oh, stop! Oh my god. Can I use it now? the way oh god run oh. no it's gone underground this is not good I need to get rid of this I'm almost there oh oh my god please don't kill me no no oh my fucking days no i can't do this i can't do this i can't do it i can't do it i can't do it i can't do it guys i can't do it i can't do it i'm stopping here no i can't do it I can't. what the fuck no way i can't do it oh here my I god am. as good as my word why does it take so long? No, this is worse than Elden Ring. <laughs> Guys, this is tough. This is actually tough. Why can't I do this bit? It's literally fucking spiders. Am I missing something here? No, I need to look on Google because this ain't making sense. This actually isn't making sense. I'm gonna watch a video right now because I've had enough. Let me see what these people do. <laughs> Guys, no, seriously, this is not okay.
Like, oh my bloody god. I just can't believe it. <laughs> I'm gonna need to watch a video. Because these are. Oh, I have no words. Maybe I should try one more time. Alright. Let's try again. <laughs> uh. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to keep... Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks, a stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Nothing to do now but keep going. Waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. I want to sleep, but I need to watch the stream while also waiting for the Fortnite service to let me in. I've been in queue for four to five hours now. Damn! Why? Wait, what's wrong with the Fortnite servers? Something oddly solemn about this place. Such oh, creatures, I have to do this bit all again. Oh. There it is, just as Jackdaw described. <laughs> Intramuros. you a little far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. When are you going to give up? Oh, for fuck's sake. It really, it is. Oh my god. Showing off, are we? Oh, fucking hell. You know what? I should really restart again. In, man. Oh, 
No risk those loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Oh my god. Let's see where Jamdor has led me. Okay. One second, guys. My cat has just came in the room. Oh, there's a there's a live event. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Why the servers are a bit bit long right now. Final showing of it is at four a.m. Damn. I wonder how big this place is. Look at the swag. Like, what is this? What is this drip, man? Hopefully, this helps. didn't want casual visitors down here. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. Oh! Avoid. Must avoid. Must avoid. At all costs. <laughs> What? They followed me? If Draco Malfoy tries to move to you, what are you do? Remarkable. Um. Hmm. If Draco Malfoy tries to move to you, what are you doing? Well. I think I'll allow it. I'll, I'll, I'll take it, you know? It comes from a, a wealthy family. He's a bit unhinged, but... He's probably, you know, soft at heart. <laughs> Do that. There. I don't want to be fighting. I need to save my health. I'm 
<laughs> Look how she's running. There it is. The bridge. It's almost complete. More spiders. These can't be what the head of Richard does. No, I wasn't meant to do it on that one. Uh, fucking jarring, bro. Oh, fucking hell. Have I done it? Oh since my Jack god. Way. No way I've done it guys. No fucking way. Oh. That was so jarring. I'll need to look around for the symbol. Not a headless skeleton in sight, but I may as well help myself to this. Oh, really? So how am I meant to do this one then? <coughs> hmm. Like, which is the first one? Oh, shit. Perhaps the next symbol is hidden somewhere. Revelio. Oh, okay, there we go, there we go. That's the order. Oh, guys, that was so stressful. What the hell? Guys, if you play this game and you do this bit, put on clothing that has high bloody offense and defense oh my god and use the rock as a shield seriously my mum is taking me to karen's diner today so i'm low-key scared but excited karen's diner isn't that um 
I think I, I think I've seen that. Wait. I must is it that dino where like they're needs. they're like rude to you or something like that? We meet oh again, God, this? Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Oh, so Here this is, is how he died. The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? Oh my god. Look at this shit. Oh no. Shit. No! Shit. God damn. Look at this motherfucker. My Spelliamus now. <sighs> oh, I'm not so sure. Oh god, he's got he's gonna jump. No, 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 get, get away, ah, ah, oh my goodness, it's your turn to die now, Yeah, they roast the living hell out of you. Oh my god, yeah, I think I've seen that. I think they have one in Australia as well, you know. But I, I remember seeing it on TikTok. The witch, witchly gun lady. Yes, I am the witchly gun lady. <laughs> oh my god. And do you mean things like putting your food on other tables? Do you mean things... Okay. Putting... Sorry, I can't even read right now. I'm just so overwhelmed by the fighting that I've just had to do. Let me read this properly. And just do mean things like putting your food on other tables and things like giving you a dance hat. Oh my god. That's crazy. In Damn, you are backing those potions. Bro, my health. Just. Yeah. What Deteriorated like I? crazy. <laughs> Starting to flood? Bro, what are you doing? How am I 
being protected. What sort of magic is this? It's that ancient magic. I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. What is this place? Wow. No, the drip. The drip is crazy. Oh my god, it's the guys. It be? Oh goodness. Fortnite servers is up again. Damn. Enjoy enjoy the live event. Fortnite do really good live events, so I doubt it'll be anything less. It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora <laughs> Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention, and might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic the few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. Oh, return? God damn. I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. Listen, the book is with Professor Fig. I bet he's done some dumb shit. I bet he's lost the book. Something is gonna happen, I'm telling you. I have a bad feeling about this. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside. Those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. Your connection to ancient magic has unlocked talents plus one. You will receive one talent point each time you increase your wizarding level. You have new talent points to spend in the talents point. Oh, talents menu in your field guide. Okay. Um. Oh, five talent points. One, two, three, four, five. Maybe I should do one one of each. Should I do that? One of each. I mean I don't I don't really care about this one, to be honest. <laughs> oh god, you know what? Just do one of each, right? Oh my god, wait, hold on. I don't know. Uh, I 
contribute to the ancient man of Utah. Perfect potato blocks contribute. Oh shit, did you see that? That dodge is crazy. Use to scroll between unlocked spells. Have a look at my spells real quick. Uh, oh yes, now I can finally put them put them on here. Wonderful. That is absolutely wonderful. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, yes, okay, that's all of them. How do I switch? Oh, wait. Okay, that makes sense. I was spare thinking as well, like, <clears throat> how do I bloody, like, add more spells? This is so convenient, my god. Oh, I have to press the button. I'll chill here for a bit because it's still three hours until 4 a.m. going through it right now. I, I bet you are, the man. Pages and the map I can't chamber. even. Lie. I'm so tired right Why now. Why would I need the book? I'm so tired. <sighs> Let's get out of here. <laughs> I don't want to do that spider section ever again. I don't know why it was so difficult. Do you know what? I need to take this these clothes off because it's just really it is it's not it's not giving. Do you know what I mean? And put them on another time. What's this? Okay, that is much better. Granny R's outfit, I know, but it helped a lot. It, it basically, uh, I don't know why, but the outfits oh, increase your defense and offense. Like what? Like, this increases it by 10, increases my defense. So, I guess 
When I fight, I have to wear my granny ass outfit. I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Hmm. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Rebellious. Oh, Wait, oh, 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 I need that. You need to learn to pulso, the banishing charm. Revelio. Objects or adversaries away. Complete the required tasks and meet me in my classroom. With an accident. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wait, whose classroom do I need to go to? Oh, I'm just gonna go here. How are you my queen? Are you enjoying the game? Um, I'm okay. I'm actually very tired now. So I might call it a day once I've gotten to this location and I can save the game. Um, but yeah, so far I'm really enjoying the game. Besides when it stutters. But that's the game's performance issue, unfortunately. Um, it's not been too bad. It was really bad earlier when I was playing during the day, but yeah, this this time it's not been as bad. So hopefully it remains in this kind of condition <laughs> for now. Because <laughs> yeah, combat at the start of the game was just terrible, but it's a lot more bearable now. Um, okay, where am I going? No, it's outside. Outside. Where's that flame? Oh, there it is. I think it's that. Oh, flying! Okay, we can do this tomorrow because I'm actually tired now. Oh, God. Um, settings. Save the game. 